Welcome to Friday! Welcome to Zero Page Homebrew, your best source for the newest Atari 2600 games. Make sure you watch at 60 frames a second, because that's what we broadcast at, and that's what the games play at. Welcome. Welcome. Yeah. You almost didn't make it. You, we almost had to call it the ambulance in, because... Uh, Cat attack. He got attacked by Pixel! Uh, and then all of a sudden looked down, and there's all blood yeah. running down his leg. Look I at that! Know. You can't, yeah. You can't see it. Yeah, anyway. You just insulted a whole bunch of people in Asia by doing that, but anyway... <sighs> We're on the wrong time yeah. <laughs> for, for Asian true, audiences. True. So. That'll satisfy the foot fetishes. Yeah. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> uh, so we're gonna Terrible. Bad kitty. Yeah, he just got excited and started running after me. And uh, his claws need to be cut. Really oh, badly. they're really bad. Yeah. That's the problem. I don't know if he intended to be so vicious. I think he just. No. Yeah. No, he's just claws are big. Uh, yeah, so we got yeah, five yeah. games to play today. Mm. We have an exclusive update on Rail Slider, which is a twin stick shooter. That we played a long oh, time ago. Yeah, yeah. Um, RC Sumo Bots, he's done an update to that, mm. where he's got little bouncy parts now, because mm -hmm. everything used to kill you. Mm. But now the interiors are bouncy and the outside walls are deadly. So you have to avoid the outside. Yeah. That makes a lot of sense. Yeah, yeah. I think that'll be a really nice improvement. Yep. Cool. Um, and then we're going to be playing a triple game homebrew stretch of games that are in part of what's called the High Score Club. Mm. which has been running for over a decade and a half. <laughs> and they have uh, games every once in a while, every all the time, actually, cool. every two weeks or every week. And um, this week, or this two weeks, mm. it's uh, homebrew. So cool. I thought, why Excellent. not incorporate it into the show yeah. and play these homebrews that we've played before and enjoy? Mm -hmm. And it's Ms. Galactopus, uh, City Defense, and Dog on it. Okay. And Arm Scar Coder is in the chat. Nice. Who is uh, the developer of uh, Dog Gone It? Nice. Yep. So uh, that'll be a lot of fun. Uh, uh, High Score Club has incredible players, and I can only hope for low top ten. <laughs> Maybe. Do we? They're really, really good players in that tournament. Like, yeah. Really good. Uh, what are the cats doing? They're just all being bad today. <laughs> oh, I want to thank all the Twitch subscribers who are running down the right-hand side on the screen, your left. Yeah. Uh, Al Nefer, Armscar Coder, mm. Cafe Man 2D, Captain Classic, uh, Catalogs, Charles and Check, Coconut E1, Dianoid, Daniel Medina, 2600, Drexel, Dr. Moo Cows, Emmanuel Ferre Ferreira, oh man, Emmanuel Ferreira. Glenn Main, Great Defender, Ground Trooper, Azure Rapper, 2600, Johnny WC, 23, Jupiter Storm, 17, Carl G. Croco, 2600, Mark Spacing, Metal Atari, 1969, Metal Lunar, Miss Command, MK Smith, Mr. Fix, Muddy Funster, Nathan Strum, Pack Rat, VG, Quahog, 2600, RC70, Repentless VG, Ricardo Pym, Six Sweets, Sir Cat Legs, Smitty Beam, 7800, Socrates 0603, Spartan 581, Esmeralds 2008, The D Train 37, Welshman 89, Thunkus, Tiki Dan K, Tim of Legend, and Trek MD. Mm. Thank you so much mm -hmm. for supporting the show. Mm. We just keep rising and rising in the support of subscriptions. It's and awesome. It's, and it's really great. Yeah. Um, and you can support the show too and subscribe for free if you have Amazon Prime and Twitch Prime, Metal Atari 1969 and Captain Classic. Raise their hands. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, Present. Brown Trooper. How many subscribers? Yeah, because you, you looked at it at the end of the last episode. Yeah, it was 46 last episode. Which is 45 great. this episode. Yeah. Somebody... You have to keep. You have to. On, yeah. You have to resubscribe. Yeah. They, and it and it does tell you because somebody subscribed for me for another channel, and through at least the web page and probably in hmm. the um, app as well, there's a little bell that highlights. And oh, says, there's a notification. Your subscription is about to run out. Oh. So they do get. Notified. But it's just kind of buried because I've never yeah. seen it. I always I always forget and then go. Oh, and then yeah. am I the one who? dropped off um well nope, you're I'm on there. the list you're I'm on the on list there. so make sure you follow subscribe and yes. click on like on all the things <laughs> twitch youtube facebook instagram and twitter there mm -hmm. ground troopers about to drop off so yeah it does tell you yeah um so happy birthday to the vcs yeah today yeah it's 43 years old wow 1977 september nice. 11th that's nice. when it was released at, upon the world nice and today we're going to celebrate it by playing some games on it what mm -hmm. better way to mm -hmm. celebrate its birthday. Mm -hmm. um, the air quality in Vancouver is very poor. 
Well, not as poor as some places. But, yeah. But um, it's like, today, all of a sudden, I, it the wind must just be blowing up from Oregon yeah. and California, and uh, it was listed as the fourth worst in the world, or North America at least, today. In Vancouver. Yeah. It's really? very bad. Yeah. I haven't. Yeah, it's. You it's, can't see the city. And you can't see the mountains right now. That's true, and the mountains you usually see. Yes, yeah. <laughs> they're it's big. It's not orange. It's no, not, no, it's not it's orange. Not it's nowhere near San Francisco. How what they were like? All that was that. insane. But it's blowing um, up here, and if you look at like yeah. the whole west coast of the U.S., it's just one big smoke cloud. Yeah, it's uh, crazy. If you see like the satellite views, so yeah, everybody down the west coast of the USA, please take care. Yeah. Um. Yeah, all all you guys, you bleeding again. Yeah, I'm still all bleeding. you guys down in California, and I know we definitely yeah. have more than a few people who, who watch oh, yeah. from there. Um, you know, all down the West Coast, so take take care, care of yourself and uh, stay out of the fire. Oh, uh, yeah, that's don't crazy. hang around your house if the fire's coming, please. <laughs> yeah, God. yeah. Um, but we had this, we had that kind of thing last year and the year before. I was looking it up. Yeah, because there were massive fires here and. It was actually looked not quite as bad oh. as what the pictures are, yeah. but it was it was post apocalyptic. It was orange we, and brown. We have had that not last year, but it might have the been year two before. years ago. It was the bad bad one. And we had we had a lot of fires in the Okanagan. <laughs> Stay out of the fires. Yeah. Always wise advice. <laughs> yeah, uh, in the Okanagan. <laughs> yeah, um, is sort of if you think of there being that deserty region that kind of travels up from California, it yeah. actually hits a bit of British Columbia yep. um, in just, the interior. Just a little bit. And then we get a lot of fires in that region as well. It's, it's almost... very dry. It's a very... It is desert. Li yeah. Literally desert. And not sand desert, there, but... Again, not nearly as bad as it's been in California, but... Yeah. Um, uh, worst comes to worst, about three miles from the bay. Mm. That means you're going to jump in the bay? Yeah. What does that mean? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, yes, yeah. jump in the bay. Yeah. Um, feedback from last episode. Yeah. With the plus cart. Yeah. Tons of feedback. Lots of viewership of it. Yeah. Um, cool. Mike Curry, this is all from uh, YouTube feedback. There's Facebook feedback as well. Yeah. Uh, this is groundbreaking. As soon as I started watching, I expected an ESP82XX board. You got it right. Um, STM Uno card definitely seems to be a great way to go MVP with this. Yeah. I'm thoroughly impressed. What an amazing episode. Thanks so much for posting it, James. You're very welcome. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, it was a lot of fun exploring all the things yeah. that go on with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Battle Dwarf said, "Never imagine I'd see the day that the incredible Atari Twenty Six Hundred could ever connect to the internet." Mm -hmm. um, Jurgen Oster said, "Amazing! Never thought this would be possible. May it be possible to buy a complete cartridge ready to plug and play?" Yes. And uh, mm. all you have to do is contact Al Nefer, mm. who is in the chat today. Excellent. Uh, Al underscore N A F U U R in Atari Age. Mm. He'll let you know what you need to do to get it from him. Mm -hmm. um, or you can build it yourself, but a lot of us can't build these things ourselves. Um, Ram Scrawl says, Now I never thought it could be possible for the 2600 to do that. Awesome vid. And Dion Ulsthorn said, Excellent show. Seeing combat played multiplayer over the internet. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. It was quite the thing. It, it, it was crazy to be able to play with Darcy from the 2600 over the internet. And yes. you play it on his end. Yeah. I mean, it, even even though it's alpha and yeah. you quickly it's, got out of sync, it's it, it worked. proof of concept in a way. Like, just to, yeah. s just show that, that totally there worked. is some back and forth, even yeah. though it's not doing exactly what it needs to. But it's yeah. still very, very cool. And uh, yeah. Ground Trooper said, my plus cart went in the mail today. Nice. So it's on its way to Ground Trooper. Nice. It's, it's really convenient to be able to access all those games without having to load them on the cartridge yeah, and also to do high scores. Yes. And um, maybe there can be a merger of the high score club and the plus card in the future. Mm -hmm. So we're going to talk about that a little later in the show mm -hmm. because they both do high scores. <laughs> um, so we're going to get on to the first game, which is Rail Slider. Okay. And this is an exclusive update we have to play on the show. It's an old exclusive update. It's okay. this build is from 2019. Okay. And it just was not released, but it is an updated version from the one in the forums. Gotcha. Yeah. And we did Excellent. play it last time uh November 7th, 2018. Oh, a little so, while ago, yeah. A little while ago. <laughs> yeah. Uh yep, 2 yep. years ago. Yeah. Um but this is updated from that one. This build is from February 28th, 2019. Still quite old. Nice. But still an unreleased um, it's been in development since 2016. It's a 32K DPC Plus, 
And, um, and I got reminded of that game because we played the demo platformer the other day. That little, you weren't here, but a uh, little bouncy guy that jumps on platforms. I think I, sh I did show it to you mm -hmm. with incredible physics. And when it trans goes from screen to screen, it goes, whoosh, like scrolls quickly from screen to screen. Mm -hmm. Very, very cool. Um, so that, that's his second game. Well, it's a demo he's making. And this and Rail Slider is his first game. So we're going to take a look at Rail Slider right now and play some of it. And it's a twin stick shooter. Um, so I don't know what we're going to do for the first little bit. Okay. Because <laughs> um, I want to read some stuff off because okay. we both kind of have to play it. Do we? Uh, at the same time. I can't hold both. Uh, maybe. Can you can try. try. Oh, <laughs> so, here we go. One second. I'm gonna switch over so we can see it too. Yep. I cannot see it. But how do you pronounce his name? Ah. Exactly right. Let's take a uh, listen on how to pronounce his name. Don't load it yet. Uh, because. <laughs> He said, hello, uh, what did he say? Hello there, Mr. James. <laughs> Me and my little brother thinks your pronunciation is hilarious. <laughs> Lila Pajenkin Pawn. Or Pawn. That's how I've been pronouncing it. Uh, Lila Pajenkin Pawn on... Okay, we're going to get it correct first. Um, so he sent me a link, or he pointed me to a link, of how to say it. And it's using text-to-speech mm. through Google, um, but you set it to Swedish mm. because it's a Swedish word. Um, so I'm going to turn it down so it doesn't blast people's eardrums. So let's take a listen. Lilla pojken poen. Uh, let's turn it up a bit for us. Lilla pojken poen. Lilla poj, P-O-J, so it's poj. poj. Kien. Kien Poen. Lila Poi Ken Poen. Still going to be poem. hard. Almost like poem. Poem. Poen. Poen. Lila Poi Ken Poen. Lila Poi Ken Poen. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Lila Poi Ken Poen. I won't remember that, so good luck. Uh, Lika Poi Ken Poen uh, means little boy on the island. It's what an ex-girlfriend used to call Adventure Island on the NES. Ah. He said, paste into Google Translate, choose Swedish, and click on the speaker button to hear how it's pronounced. Yeah, I never knew Poen. that you could drop it down or set it to that language, and then you could get Just Google play it. Yeah. to pronounce it. That's amazing. Yeah. He said, Rail Slider was the first thing I ever programmed, and I'm very proud of it, not just as a game. Mm. I wanted to make a twin-stick shooter similar to Robotron with a lot of stuff going on, and the boss and extra life bonus as in Beam Rider. Mm. The game project is dead, <laughs> but unfortunately there is an awesome Robotron port for the Atari 2600 now. So he's, he's done. It's completed at this point. So I don't know um, if he really ever said that in the thread that he's like, I'm done, done with it, but it is. Um, I don't have access to the latest version, uh, but the, this build is newer than the one in the forum. Why doesn't he have access to the latest version? It's very strange. <laughs> Isn't it his game? Uh, PAL colors though, so it's going to be a little bit off because we're playing, it's a PAL 60 version, mm. which plays on the 26, NTSC 2600, mm. but the colors are wrong because mm. they're PAL colors. It still looks fine, mm. but to play it properly, still playable and you have to play it on a PAL okay. um, Atari 2600. Um, it has the power-up weapon turned on at all times, so it's easier to shoot the extra life and Mega Blast missiles. The title music is a demo track from TIA Tracker by Glafoak. So let's take a listen to that. Oh, you're not even in the menu. Where are we? What? What day Today, is it? Today's date. <laughs> Rail slider. Excellent. <laughs> nice. So we'll just take a listen to that for a second. So it's actually really good. Mm. Yeah, it, it sounds good and it's and it it looks good. It's really colorful. Tie action. Mm. 
Um, so I'm going to turn down just a little bit for you guys out there. Um, so that's that's moving. Okay. It's only left and right. So uh, you might be able to do it, and that's shooting. I think this up is up down, or is that that's um, up down and angles up and down. As Could well. we reverse these? Wouldn't wouldn't. Uh, oh. Do you think that would be better? Well, if this is just left and right, that might actually be doable. I don't think that's going to be better. No, you don't. This is going to be easier to move left and right because right. it's just really simple. And this right. is an all direction pad, right? Whoa! Who am I and where am I? You're in the middle. And you should be shooting at all times. I'm going forward. What is going on? Well, I'm moving left and right. What am I moving left and right? Oh, the thing in the middle! <laughs> the only thing that moves left and right. <laughs> you said you're the thing in the middle. I'm like, yeah, I'm the not thing controlling the, the people who are running around. No, okay. they're not in the middle. They're moving gotcha. all over okay, the place. Gotcha. Okay, let's try this again. Oh, uh, I get it. wonder if Brothers Chaps could revive Homestar as a, as a whole with HTML and pick up their held cancelled projects. As a whole? Uh... Nutty says, well, it's called Homestar, but we all know Strong Bad is a real star. Um, if you go back in old episodes, there's actually a Homestar Runner RPG. And it and it's pretty nice looking, actually. But it was discontinued, unfortunately. Um, everyone I've shown the game to has no idea what they're looking at, as the robots are either bugs or monsters, and the giant robot head that pops up is either a UFO or a hamburger. Uh, I did, however, like the minigame after killing the boss, so I'm starting to turn that into a standalone minigame with graphics that can't be mistaken. If I can find and make it playable, I'll send it to you when I send the game instructions before the stream. And he did the send that to me, so I'll be taking a look at that. <laughs> Having some trouble. No, I'm just trying to get comfortable. Oh, okay. Whatever works. Okay, game instructions. Just like in Beam Rider, you get bonus points per life after killing the boss. What is this this thing in the middle that runs back and forth? Just avoid it. How can I avoid it? You just don't it just runs run into it. Don't run along with it. And oh. That minimizes your exposure to exposure it. Exposure to it. Does it does it hurt you? Well, I'm going to read the instructions right yeah, now. Yeah, that would be nice. Because yeah. they were never posted with the original game. <laughs> okay. And we had no idea what we were doing what we were doing when we played it originally because there literally was no instructions. It was just like figure it out. We didn't even know it was a twin stick shooter. <laughs> when we first played it. Um, the boss shows up every time 10,000 digits rolls over in the score. So you're at 700. Okay, very far from it. It's going to take a very long time. Uh, the speed of the robots, their missiles, and rail slider speeds up very slightly every 100 points. Uh, if you shoot the robots as fast as possible, they won't have time to shoot you, and you won't collect any special missiles. Oh, so you shouldn't shoot them immediately. <laughs> Is what he's saying. You want to collect their missiles? Yeah, you want to... Doesn't it injure you, though? Well, I'll keep reading. Big green missile is a power-up weapon. A lot easier to hit the enemy's missiles with this. This is enabled all the time in your version. So we already have that. We have the big power-up. So I guess that doesn't happen. There is no big green missile. Or it does nothing. Big blinking missile, which I have seen. That. Is I think it like that's, a red? It's like no, red. they're all missiles. Sometimes it's blinking. I've just been avoiding. Yeah, you're supposed to shoot it. A uh, big orange missile is one extra life. And I'm sure that doesn't come too often. So that was oh, a blanking one. I saw, one. saw that, yeah. Uh, pausing with player one button shows how many lives and how many Mega Blasts you have. Oops, that's a Mega Blast. Oh, you're, what are you doing? What did you do? Destroyed it. Move around. Oh, it killed you. We'll figure out what Oh, thanks that does. for that. <laughs> What's pausing? Uh, it says player oh. one button, but that's what I just pressed, right? Yeah, but, but I But it did a mega blast instead. But I, I never used that one, so it doesn't... Uh, the pink missile is the boss making his presence known. It just forces you to the side and adds some difficulty. The pink missile. Is that the thing that goes back and forth? Is it pink? Yeah. It forces you to the side. And you've lost. Ah, this. that would explain a lot. Thank you. Uh, the S thing during the boss is currently the way to slow game speed down again. There's three during every boss fight. 
forces you to the side. But it goes all the way left and right. Guess you haven't picked up a Mega Blast yet. And it fell out again. It's useless. Useless! Useless controller. How are you making it fall out all the time? Because, because it's hitting the pillow. Oh. It, it falls out just from movement, too. Yeah. Okay. It's uh, cool. I guess when the pink metal is in the middle, the only way to dodge it is to move all the way to one side. Yeah, you have but to not just really. go, it goes, go through. Oh, it, it doesn't go all the way to that side. No, it bounces, so... No, like if you went all the way to the left, it would avoid you, because it can't get there. Oh, I see. So go all the way to the left. Ah, you can avoid it. Oh, there we go. That makes sense. Killing the robots with a Mega Blast gives you more points, but it also drains your energy. Yeah, and then you somehow did it continuously. So oh, did it get pulled out? That would explain it. Uh, I couldn't stop it. It's killing the robots with a Mega Blast. Uh, so make sure you move to one side and wait for as many robots as possible to enter the room before executing it. It will also snatch up any missiles being fired. Okay. <clears throat> Oh, we also have 2600 in the chat who made uh, City Defense, which we'll be playing later on in the show. Um, so in the forums, he said, this is my first attempt at Batari Basic. So this was made in Batari Basic. It has stood uh, still for a while, so I'm posting it, and I have a place to ask questions and finish it. It's a twin stick shooter, so play it with two Sega Mega Drive arcade sticks. I play it with two Sega Mega Drive arcade sticks. Um, hold down on any joystick while boosting or restarting to start with 9900 points and five mega blast if you want to see the new boss and special attack quicker so you can actually set it in the game so you can jump straight to the boss which we'll do if we don't if you don't make it is there any way to get more energy does it ever go up or is does it just continuous the do the missiles help you at all oh. oh you did gain energy there because you still had four lives and then your energy went to the full Hmm. Uh, new demo, hold the pause button, fire button on joystick 2. Hold the pause buttons on joystick 2. Uh, while starting from the title screen to start with 99,990 points. Uh, and after the after the last time we played it on the show, uh, he posted saying, So funny to see you try to figure it out. Especially when you got mad at Erland for shooting the big orange missile. When you're trying to capture it. That is how you ca That is how you capture it. Uh, he got By an extra. It? He got an extra life there. Yes. Oh, so you f you hit the missile. Yes. Not that one. No, uh, no. The one that those robots are shooting. So it, shooting it's the a, missile is not like is that, fun. That one. That's an extra life. No, there was an orange one. There's a red one and an orange. That one. was a pink missile. No, it wasn't. I thought you said the orange one was the extra life. Uh, he's getting his colors all mixed up here. See, that was an orange one there. I don't know. A big orange missile, one extra life. A blinking missile, mega blast. There's only two. So there's a blinking one and an orange one. So if it's not blinking, that's your extra life. Get away from me. <laughs> the, the controller. Oh. Slide, keep sliding away. Yeah, you're, yeah, you're pushing it down on the pillow, which is pushing well, I can't, it out. Well, I can't help that. I can't hold it in my hands, so it has to sit on something. Uh, let's see. Yep. There we go. Okay, that's the end of that. No, nope, not done yet. <laughs> <laughs> it's the end of me reading the instructions. You gonna help so you, me? Yep, I can help you if you want. Thank you. do kind of bunch up on you when you go to the side. Mm -hmm. And you should definitely just try to avoid the bullets because I can't shoot them all. So we have to get to... We're almost there. Halfway there. Maybe the boss is a little too high of a score. <gasps> you press the button. 
Didn't think so. No, it thinks you did. <laughs> I must have. It worked. Yeah, it did. <laughs> Let's try the pause. There we go. So that's, so that's life the pause? Mega. Oh, so the thing on the right hand yeah. side mm. is how much Mega Blast you have. Ah. And it depletes when you press it, but mm. it's also your life at the same time. So if it goes down to zero, you lose a life. Mm. Ready? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's definitely worthy of a cart release. I think he should continue. Maybe he lost the code. That's why he doesn't have the latest well, he's build. in the chat, so... Oh, is he? Yeah. Oh, welcome. Yeah, he was making fun of your uh, pronunciation. Earlier. Oh, no, what? <laughs> yeah. So I'm still failing. Um, so what is the deal with the code and that you, you said you don't have the code? You don't have the latest build. Did you... Um, was it a factor that you lost the code and you can't uh, rebuild it? Because that would definitely be a hindrance. You could disassemble it and rebuild it from scratch again. Yeah, I think the boss is way too high of... Um, well, considering nothing's really changed in the gameplay. That's the thing. They're not really getting much faster or harder. Mm -hmm. I mean, we're about to lose. Oh, we got all of our life back. Must ah! Oh, don't run with it! Oh my god. <laughs> You're like almost down to zero. Down to zero? No, I've got lots. No, you just lost a life. That's why. Because you were running with that beam. So it was just taking all your life. Oh, just missed that extra life. No, you hit, you shoot it. You have to shoot it. I know, I missed it. Oh. Can't see his room. His okay. answer. <laughs> uh, you have to choose which. Oh, uh, you ran with it again. No, I. We're not gonna make it to the I'm boss. Because I'm trying to read the chat. <laughs> Don't. Oh, we lost another life. We lost another life. Oh, because we were in the corner. Oh my god! Don't don't sit in the corner. I can't get a good angle on them. They're moving faster now. Yeah, they definitely are. It says every hundred. Oh, this is exhausting with my fingers. Yeah, it is exhausting. Try to do it with two hands. <laughs> two hands. <laughs> yeah. Let's see if we get to the last. Oh, now they we're down like to the last faster. life. Wait, they are. He says every hundred they go faster. Mm. I don't think every we're gonna make it. Every hundred they go faster. Or every thousand. You said hundred. Oh. That's okay. You need a pink or orange, whatever color it is. Oh, down to half. Oh, oh. Oh, oh my god, down to nothing. Aww. 7,000 is pretty uh, good, though. All right, what did we miss? Nothing. <laughs> pretty you have to shooter. choose what direction to shoot the Mega Blast. Mm. With the other direction pad would make more sense with two sticks. Hitting any missile is good, yes. Mm. Um, I'm surprised no one uses Pokey on the 2600. Mm. Would it work? That's interesting. I've never heard any discussion about using the Pokey chip on the 2600 because that's a chip they developed for the 7800. Mm. Interesting. Okay, so should we try again to get... 10,000? Yeah. Oh, just press the button. Uh, uh, why, why are you pressing the button? Oh, sorry. Oh, I'm getting goodness. confused. Don't forget, just direction, direction. Direction. Yeah, I'm, I'm like pausing. <laughs> Yeah, you're pausing over and over again and not shooting. Why is it being weird? I don't know. All I'm doing is pushing the... Yeah, are you plugged in? No, I'm fine. Just looked weird. We're getting tons of extra lives there, but we're full, so... Yeah, it's, it's not when you need them that you get them. Yeah, you want to stay in the corner as little time as possible. Like you were staying, you're staying in the corner, and I couldn't shoot. Well, I was trying not to accidentally. Shoot! I was trying not to accidentally <laughs> run into them. Okay. Yeah. Like the thing in the middle. Very reminiscent of like the look of the robots in Robotron. Like you're the exact same speed as it. So as soon as it hits a corner, you can get out of it. Very, very colorful enemies. Mm -hmm. um, super high action. Um, 
You do have to have the right joysticks to play the twin stick. I really want that twin stick. Yeah. Uh, Ed Ladden. So somebody out there get it for me for Christmas? <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Ed Ladden, are you watching? <laughs> I'll use it every show. Because I love arcade sticks for playing. For games like this, like yeah. I, I'm not a fan of the D-pad because you're, not there's for this. so much movement. It's, it's not great for a lot of movement, yeah. So far we're doing perfect. Oh, we're only at 2,000, so. <laughs> <laughs> Good energy. How do you get yeah. energy back? Probably is it through missiles or no? Is it the You just get extra things? lives. Oh I don't think you get energy back. Uh, yeah, so do you lose a life? Oh, there. Oh, you know what? It only shows four lives, but I think you can get more in reserve. That's why when it's going down to zero, and then you... You're, it looks like you're, re you're getting more, but you're actually not. using a life that's not on the screen kind of thing? Yeah, I think that's it. Because I was like baffled why that was happening. And, I, and we just went down, and, uh, and then it, the energy was at full again. Yeah, there's, there's a bit of a Robotron vibe with the uh, robots. Yeah. And the twin stick. The shooting with one and moving with the other. Oop, got a little bit of that. So we're almost down in energy and, yeah, we reset and we still have four lives. So yeah, there's tons in reserve. Or at least eight. <laughs> Depending on how, uh, how many digits he... Mm. Uh, used for it? How much space you used for it? You can't read the place. No, you can't. Time. You can't read it's the chat, unfortunately. It's it's a little we'll too catch fast. Up. We'll catch up. Catch up after. It, they, they seem relatively quick games. Yeah. My goodness. We're almost there. <laughs> no, we're not. We're halfway there. I love the colors of the robots. I love oh, I love great. The paint, their the animation flashing. and the flashing and flashing the helmet. blue helmet and the whole thing. They're sure. really, really, really nice. Yeah. yeah. A little walking animation they have. They're lifting their feet up. They move their arms? Mm, yeah, they do. It kind of blinks their arms. Oh my god. What? Right, you is... went through it. Oh no. <laughs> Silly. Silly. Bad mistake. That's what get, when you're talking or trying to look at the chat, that's what happens. That's exactly right. <laughs> Don't look at the chat. I guess it does give out a number of lives because I think we've gone through like four now. You think so? Yeah. Yeah. We watched a uh, really good uh, documentary last oh, night. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, I really, uh, Netflix was heavily advertising it to me and to you, too, I yep. think. Yeah. All about the social dilemma. Yeah, the social dilemma. Highly recommended. I wasn't a huge fan of the fictional part of it. They tried to give real life examples by having actors um, live a life of social media addiction. Um, it got a little better towards the end, and I can see what they were trying to do. Well, they were trying to show it without it being, I guess, like, oh, we're in someone's living room, and this is this is their life. Like, you would wait yeah. forever for someone to ha experience what they were trying to depict. So I kind of get it. Yeah, but, it just um, wasn't good at the you beginning. didn't You really didn't like, like that approach, but I thought it was well done. And the actors in it were, like... Top-notch actors. Top-notch, like... like the acting wasn't because no, I think well. of the writing and the direction, but the um, 
Yeah, it was fine. Was it was fine, but, but it, it they're wasn't. They're like known actors. Yeah, the actors were like, how do we know them from? And the, there was an actress in there from uh, Moonrise Kingdom, was yep. it? Like, and the main actor was from Spider Man. From yeah, kind of crazy. Anyway, I'm like I recognize these people. I had to look them up to see who they yeah. were. And it's, it is a documentary, so. Uh, yeah, it's all about um, the influence of social media in our lives, and it's it's, it's well more done. than you think. It's it's not fluffy at all. No. They have like the top people to talk to. Yeah, all about, about this. All ex employees, like top ex employees of Google all the social media. Social media sites. Facebook, and... Instagram, yeah. uh, LinkedIn, Twitter, all the huge ones. It is Quite really, good. really yeah. good. And and it just scares the hell out of you actually. Yeah, yeah. I mean I knew most of it. Uh, there was a couple things in there. I was like, What? Wow, okay. But most of it I, I knew about. But they really tied it all together and, and put it together in a very yeah. cohesive package and ramped it up really well. Like the, like the it, information and the and the sort of the um, what the scariness I say, of the it. The scariness of it, yeah. The the importance of it. Like yeah. if they jumped right to like three quarters in, you'd be like, nah, no, I think you're over exaggerating. But the way they presented it, they made you understand how uh, malicious and manipulative social media is yeah. that you're not quite aware with, of. With a very heavy emphasis on, on sort of the algorithms and the AI and yeah. how there's a lack of control over what it's actually doing. And that, that I think is the shock, the most shocking thing is, yeah. is, is, uh, it's linking things and suggesting things to people that are exacerbating, um, social issues as far as, uh, on both sides, on, 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 on what every people side, believe. it puts them into bubbles and feeds them the information things. that without showing any contrasting information is essentially what it is. It's like you click on quite something interesting and then it's going to keep showing you that thing because it knows you like clicking on that thing and it won't show you opposing viewpoints. Yeah. Because it's not in its best interest to show you opposing him. Yeah. Viewpoints. It wants to just keep you looking at whatever you We're like. Almost there. Yeah. We're almost Woo! there. Bosses. We have full lives or we don't well, know. <laughs> not full lives, but pretty good. We have at least four lives. Okay, I'm, I'm excited now. 97. Almost a 10. Almost a 10. 98. 99. Woohoo! <gasps> Finally. Shoot, shoot! Don't stop shooting. <laughs> oh, shoot the S's too. What, like the stuff that's below? On the bottom when it comes across. Shoot the S, shoot the S, shoot the S. Sorry, it's hard. There we go. What does the S do? Ah, I think we have to use like our mega bomb. <gasps> yeah! And we get points for every life we have. <laughs> oh, oh, oh ah. no, it just starts again! <laughs> Stop pressing the button! Stop pressing the button! Stop pressing the button. I'm not pressing the button. Why is it pausing? I don't know. I'm not pressing anything. I'm pressing the button. <gasps> Threatening me, or accusing something. me, something. It's it's it's. Oh no! It's pausing every time. This is this is every time you get something. This is the bonus wave. Oh, is it? Oh yeah. shoot! I should be shooting more. Up yeah. down, up down, up down, up down, up down. Or I'll just stay in the middle. You do angles. Oh, it's, it's hard. No, 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 no. Don't do that. It's really okay. hard to hit them on the angles. Wow! Very cool. Very 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 cool. Oh my goodness. I'm really enjoying this. I love the color, the gradation change of the yes, color. And the robots beautiful. are pink now. Were they red before? Were they always pink? They were different. Oh, this is. I mean, this fingers. is Pal, so it's <laughs> totally not the right colors he intends. That's oh, still cute, though. Yeah, still looks great, even though it's like crazy oh colors. God, they're so fast now. Yes. Um, I think we're gonna lose lives faster now. Yeah, we're gonna die soon. <laughs> um, I think the boss should come a lot earlier. Do you think so? It's like the boss at, wasn't at five thousand. The boss wasn't too hard. No, that's yeah. why I think you should come earlier yeah. and more often. And more often, yeah. Like three thousand to five thousand, somewhere in that range, because it's just such a long wait to have a have a break, mm. right? But I think the score ramps up 
because we're already at 4,000. And that didn't take very long. I'm going for it. Oh, maybe not. Did you do that? Yep. Just for fun. Oh, there's a pink one. I think. Because we haven't used it. But it it destroys your life, though, right? So yeah, it does. I don't know what reason that you would use it, unless it was during the laser thing where you're stuck in the corner and all the oh, all this attacking and you're, you. yeah, maybe like, maybe it saves you getting smushed. It does. It only uses keep shooting. It only uses up a little bit of your life. So that's not too bad. It uses a little bit of energy, isn't it? As long as you hold it, though. You uh, killed nope. me last time because you held it indefinitely. Oh, it it got held. I didn't hold it. it was, the thing fell out. Oh, That's okay. What it that was. must have been what happened. So I just press it and it does its thing. Oh, down to two lives. Oh, boy. We're at 6,000. Because I've been using that thing. <laughs> uh, no, one life. Shoot them! No! They're getting right to the line now, so quickly. And my fingers are getting sore, so... <laughs> oh! We got live back! Oh my god. How did that happen? Must have shot a pink Need more! Thing. Need more! No! Oh! Down to one! No. no! Need more pink! No! Need more pink! They're so fast! My fingers can't go that fast. Uh. Oh no! Down to one more! Down oh. to the last life! What are you doing? Why I was gonna die this? either way, because no, the robots weren't. were coming. Yep. No, you weren't. So it's oh. got best score and last score. Nice. Cool. Nice. Oh. It gives a thousand points per robot? Nice. What does? No, it doesn't. When? If it was a thousand points a robot, you'd have to kill ten and you get to the boss. A hundred. It's a hundred. hundred points Isn't a robot. A unless it Unless he means the Oh, boss. on the mega. Oh, that's why we're up so high. Oh. So the mega gives you a thousand. That makes That's sense. That's why it's so okay. slow. We could have got up way faster. That makes so much sense. Here, we'll switch. Gotcha. And we're just gonna play it for a little bit. What? We're done now. Hold on. Pause. I just I need a drink. Okay. <laughs> That's what we were missing. Is that you're supposed to use the mega blast to get lots mm. of score by getting a lot of robots on the screen. So it's just the button? Yeah. Just to that Just triggers. one hit. That's it. Just make it don't blast. have that fall out. Yeah. Okay. Enough. Press the button to go. So, do you you don't pick up now. mega blast? No. Now. I now. can't. What are you talking about? Hmm? Don't you have to pick up a mega blast? Oh yeah, you, you do. You have to pick them up. But I thought that bar was an indicator of it. See, that was one. Right now it's another one. Oh, okay. There's only two on the screen. Yeah, but that's okay. I just. But wanted... it wasn't a thousand robot. We just got two robots. <laughs> maybe it amps up. Oh, as as maybe at the higher level. Yeah, that's why. Twenty six hundred just subscribed. Thank you very much. Twenty six hundred. Okay, we're done. I I think the robots amp up. Mmm. Okay. Very 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 cool. Um, I need to know though. What happened to his code and why? I don't know. Is it in here? Lots of chats while we were playing. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Pause to see how many lives you really have. Oh, oh okay. okay. And you get 10,000 a lot faster if you use your Mega Blast. Okay. Yeah. And that's why pausing is helpful mm -hmm. because you can see how many extras you have. Um, go up more. Yorkie's Castle. I nuked my Twitter last week. <laughs> <laughs> Probably for the best. Yeah. Uh, oh. Do you want to scroll? Okay. Because I want to know yeah, if he answered <laughs> that what happened to his code. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, pause. Anybody? Uh, you have chose direction should blah blah blah. Hitting any missile is good. No, it doesn't. That's player zero. Move to the side. It turns around. We missed New... a lot of chat. <laughs> yeah. New computer and source is on an old one. 
but had a build on my Harmony Card SD. Oh, okay. So you do have the source code. It's just on an older computer mm. that you need to get. Mm. Well, you should get it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I, yeah, good. So there we go. Excellent. Super fun. Super, super fun. So we'll I move wish on we had to the, the twin sticks. Game. Yeah. Yeah, they're like $300 yeah, yeah, yeah. shipped here for the twin sticks mm. of the 800 so that's a bit uh, a rough go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's a quality product, and I would really love it. So, I mean, this is annoying. I mean, we do have to just screw it in. Here you go. Um, so this is, I believe, a two-player only game, right? There's no AI in this. No, I don't okay. think there was the last time we played. So this is RC Sumo Bots. Um, and it's been recently updated um, with some new type of gameplay. So this is this builds from September 8th. This is by uh, Carl G. Other games, Cannons, Toy Shop Terminator, Space Game, Penult, is a big one, uh, RC Sumobots, and Robot Tag. Um, he said, after watching the show, I think there... Uh, oh, Thomas Yanch said, after watching the show, I think there should be a variation with high friction and more thrust. <laughs> that would change the gameplay quite a lot you would get real sumo action then and Carl G said that's a good idea maybe it could be ground bots or air bots mm -hmm. for the friction versus non-fiction then he said version 9 added to the first post this version adds a game variety with friction for each of the board types mm -hmm. uh, the variants with friction use a different color scheme to distinguish them oh. so oh, nice. that and then the friction version oh. normal friction normal, normal friction. friction neat so we'll do uh, that one. Yeah. I'll let you move Good night, D train. Good night, D train. Sorry, Thanks you're feeling under out. the weather. Oh. Hope you feel better. Um, so try and move around. This is friction. Yeah. So it slows you down. So stop moving. Well, move and then stop moving. Yeah, I did. Stop moving. Um. Uh, I'd be interested to hear if the friction level is too much, too little, or feels just right. Um, then he updated the po post to version 10 on uh, Tuesday. Now the middle parts of the arena act as bouncy bumpers instead of being lethal. Uh, of mm. course, this is the level with no middle part. There. Let's there. do the friction one. There you go. Yeah. Let's get a good Makes run at it from too. the side. There you go. Ooh. Nice. Very nice. This has only been lately tested, so I'd be interested to hear how well it works for anyone who tries it. So let's try it out. So the sides, the outside sides, are the parts that are deadly now. I think this was an issue last time, where you have the same amount of power as the other person, so oh. Oh, you ran right into it. I'm green, by the way. No, I, I, Tanya, I know. <laughs> no, I'm telling them. Okay. Ah. And Tanya is purple. So what I'm noticing is is the edges. Ah! Ah! Uh, the, I'm, I'm playing with the edges, so I'm not caring about my score too much. That's it excuse. bounces you straight back. It bounces you straight back. So straight. that you, you, don't, you don't bank off of it or anything oh, like that. Oh, no. He didn't implement that. No. So... I think he was thinking about implementing um, proper physics for those, but um, he didn't put that in yet. Anyway, he may he may still do it. Ah! No, 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 no! Can get a little bit of momentum. Yeah. <laughs> oh! Ho, ho. Need like a boost, a but like a boost, one boost. You get one only, like to give you an extra little bit. Ugh. Or you can put them scattered around the arena. That would be good. Because right now, if we push against each other, it doesn't do anything. So you have to use different tactics, like ev evading and then pushing. What do you think about the friction? Is it too much? I don't think so. It's pretty good. It's like bouncing to build up speed. Yeah. Mm. Oh my god. <laughs> Fun. It is like bouncing. Bumpers just reverse your momentum. 
Battle of the Roombas. Yeah, <laughs> pretty much. You oh, power you have no, no, no power. control. <laughs> no control. Ah! Yep. Too soon. Gotta build up the power. Build up the power. Oh. oh I'm running into it. It's a little bit off. You kind of transfer your power to them, it looks like, doesn't it? Yeah. Like, whatever momentum you had directly goes to <gasps> them. No, no. Hmm. Ah, that was bad. <laughs> oh, that's an interesting spelling of Tanya. <laughs> Tan oh, I see. It's two words. <laughs> Tanya. <laughs> Yes. Tanya has. Yeah, 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 yeah. Has got the strategic value of the rebound down. Yes. Yeah, you want to get your yes. momentum up. Ah, because you do transfer it. Damn it. <laughs> but it can go against you. It can. Because you, you transfer it. <laughs> yeah. How fast can you go? Oh, this is fun. <laughs> I wonder if you set an upper limit or if it'll roll around, roll over. After oh, 255. Oh, it does slow. I'm, I'm, I'm reducing my friction. The friction is slowing me down. Interesting. Oh, I can't break out of this. I, if I'm pressing up, oh, I'm barely going up. Oh, <laughs> wow. Okay, so you transferred all your momentum to all me, even it. though I hit you from the side. Yeah. The physics are not... Not perfect, correct. but it's kind of fun to play with. <laughs> it's, it's like different physics. It is different physics. But that's fine. It's yeah. fine. Like, there are a lot of games like that where the fix physics don't quite make sense. Oh! Ah, oh! Yeah, I got the right bounce there. Yeah. Because as long as you know the rules of the game, it it works. Oh, no, 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 no! Get in there! <laughs> Alternative physics. Yeah. Alternative physics. Yes, That's what it is. Pretty much. Ooh. Sometimes I hit and I'm like, oh, I wouldn't have thought I would have hit that. I do like the uh, Battle of the Roombas. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Battle of the Roombas. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Just put some cat hair. Along the way. Ah! I ran so, right into you. So we had we had a vacation booked a while back. Yeah. For May of this year. And... Um, oh, we were started. Oh, okay. Let's play a different arena. Yeah. Pass-throughs. Let's play non... This is without the friction? This is without the friction. Oh, so yeah. you have to slow You're yourself really, down. You're really, really... Oh! You're really floaty. And the place we booked it for didn't give us a refund because I think we tried to get we tried to get the refund as soon as like the planes, all the planes shut down and everything. Oof. And they're like, no, no money for you. You can have it in uh, our own special credit. Yeah. And so we went to book uh, a vacation the other day. Yeah. Because using the credit far off in the future <gasps> using the credit but within within our our province yes so we don't have to travel we don't have to go on a plane yeah it's it's going to be relatively you know safe and it's yeah. and it's well into the future in, in next year yeah so it's either going to be much much worse or better <laughs> by <laughs> hopefully <then>. better <laughs> <laughs> yes hopefully not much much worse um but we had to we had to use credit with them so we can only book in places that they oh 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 my god barely made oh. that through yeah that they listed yeah and then we went to book them and it does not work as proper credit we found out well it does but it only works for certain places yeah it's not just a dollar's a dollar's a dollar it only works for, oh, you can only spend it there. Or here. Or it only or works a little bit there. But we eventually found a place, the most expensive place <laughs> in the whole town that they offered. Yeah, which is fine. So it goes up to six? No. Yep. Press button? Or does it start over? Oh, no, still going. No, sorry, I just... I... And it almost used it up exactly, <gasps> the amount that we had. 
like to the yeah. almost $100 which, credit. Which is is fine. But, I mean, but I think there was only two places there that supported There were only two it. places that supported the One the was credit. quite low end. No, and, it wasn't that wasn't bad. It? Oh, okay. but, but of all the offerings, it were, there were two. So could color the bumpers do? and the death walls differently. In this mm. one you might be able to because mm -hmm. they're they're on different uh, different yeah. levels, different verticalities. But say that one be more challenging. No, because they might you could plan it on different lines. Yeah. People aren't seeing where I'm pointing. <laughs> um, no, they're not. <laughs> it, it, like that one would be much harder. Like this one. Um, it would have to be slightly off from. Yeah, I see what you're saying. Yeah. Because you'd have to change the color yeah. between the left to the middle and then change it back again. Yeah. And I don't know what scheme this is using. Is this a DPC plus game? Looks like he's using DPC plus, maybe. Maybe there's enough time. Nope, it's just, whew, look at it go. Coming to get you, see what happens. Uh, that's what. <laughs> 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 because it transfers your exact that was um, awesome. vector to the other person. Yeah, it does. Yeah. Well, you got you you were centered. I was on the edge, so yes. I hit the wall. <laughs> we could have just kept going back and forth. One line kernel for players and playfield. Oh, it's a one line kernel. Uh. <laughs> oh, there we go. Bonk. <laughs> Bonk. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious! <laughs> I'm enjoying this a lot, actually. Are you Are you accelerating? Yep, I'm accelerating. I, oh, is, now we've caught up to each other. I'm going to slow down. There is an upper limit. You'll You'll catch up to me eventually. And then boost there you go. forward. <laughs> oh, that's, that's so funny! Funny. Isn't that moving smoothly or kind of push pull? I'm pushing back on you now. Yeah, it's very smooth here, very smooth there, so it's, yeah, it looks fine. I'm kind of enjoying this. <laughs> it's hilarious. <laughs> oh! Um, I did that on purpose. Yeah, no, that's fine. Yeah, it could be video latency. Yeah, yeah. it's smooth. Yeah, it's very smooth here. Um, yeah, I, I think the uh, friction is about right. Yeah. Yeah, it's not too much and it's not too little I think no it's i about think friction right. is pretty good yeah yeah i would like the two to see uh better physics on bounces uh, yeah they're, they're not bouncing like, how I you might expect something to bounce off something i want to go to well, i guess we can't use that use the single one the yeah, single, single one in the easiest. middle yeah so oh, it, i want to do friction though so you stand the top oh, i'm gonna, gonna bounce go. vertically so you bounce back instead of and it should be like like that like, I yeah. think that would be, even if it's not perfect, just like take the uh, angle I mean, you're, and reverse it's, the, the, neg the, the negative of it. Of it's the essentially horizontal acting and like vertical. a circle. It's bouncing you straight back. It's not, it's yes. not you're not reflecting. So off. you just have to, the, all he has to do is change the horizontal um, vector to yeah. the opposite. It's fine. You just, oh, you're it is just fine. bouncing off of it like it's a pole, you know, like yeah. you're, you're bouncing straight back. Yeah, and it doesn't make sense. Well, it 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 because it looks square, like, it doesn't make sense, but Yeah. Yeah. Like when you hit it head on, of course that makes sense. It, but it's only because it's reversing just one. Mm -hmm. But he's not reversing the horizontal ever, right? Yeah. But I wanna try it on the vertical here. One second. I think I already have bouncing off the vertical. Oh it, yeah. It all because all he would have to do is remember the direction it was going to reverse it. Mm. Because he's now reversing, he's always reversing the horizontal. Mm. Yeah, he's always mm. reversing the horizontal and the vertical, but never inverting it. Yeah. Bumpers only reverse momentum. I tried to research po proper physics for collisions, but my head hurt. Yeah. I might see about a collaborate with someone more intelligent. <laughs> I think somebody would well, be able to tell you uh, how to figure that out fairly. Because this this works fine, right? 
Andrew Davies said convert XY to an angle and then add 180, then back convert. Hmm. Oh, um, yeah. That's a lot of processing power for the poor little 2600. Uh, that might work. I don't know. Um, but the, yeah, that would work for sure if there's enough time to do that calculation. I bet there's some, some tables, some lookup tables he could use. Depends mm -hmm. how much of the 4K he's already used. Um, some rough work. It's reversing both at the same time. It's not checking, checking which, which side, side bumps. bumps. Yeah. Yes. Because it's doing a simple collision. It doesn't know where it collided this on is, the ball. This is one of those streams where people are like, why are there like Roombas? <laughs> Bouncing just, in the middle. Just, just running into this tiny little... Uh, <laughs> Square in the middle of the screen. They just don't understand how this game's played. <laughs> this is how you play it. Yeah. By bouncing into the center. It, it, they remind me of, um, because of the little tail, uh, what do you call them? The sea creatures. Uh, sea creatures with a little tail and yeah. they're round? They're big, big. Ugh. <laughs> I can picture uh, them. They floaty like ones? Yeah, they're like big. They're huge. They they're killed Steve Irwin. Through. Oh, stingrays. Stingrays. Yeah, th yeah, stingrays. I'm like, that's all I can think of. You know, the animal that killed Steve <laughs> <laughs> Battle of the Roombas is a great name. Yeah. <laughs> yep. It's officially changed the name from RC uh, Sumo Bots to Battle of, of the, the Roombas. Roombas. <laughs> <laughs> Roomba Battle Bots. Yes, yes. Room, room yeah. Battle Bots. Roomba. Roomba Battle Bots. No, he's con concatenated Room Battle it. Bots. Yeah, that's pretty room good too. Because this is a room. Yeah, right? it is. <laughs> um, would X equals minus X, Y equals minus Y? That should work, shouldn't it? Oh, like, man. press the button? Yeah. It's very annoying. Press it to start over. You can't do anything. Just hit it. Um, <laughs> yeah, see, Y, if you do this, uh, reversing Y um, works. Um, and, of course, if you do this, reversing X works. But if you do this, no, it doesn't. What you want is the a one on this one, X, to be the same. So how do you get the program to distinguish where you're hitting on it? That's the problem, really. He would have to know where it's being hit on... You could do that by... Uh, you'd have to check collision on every line. Because it's checking for collision on the sprite. Hmm. And you'd have to check collision every line. So if it hits, if the collision is on the top half of the sprite, you know you have to do... Or does that even work? Oh, press the button. Because is this the same formula as that? It is. But this is kind of expected. Like if you're in the corner, that kind of makes sense, doesn't mm -hmm. it? I don't know if it's solvable <laughs> because it has a lot to do with where you're bouncing off of. Like this makes sense, but this, get out of my way, but this doesn't make sense. So I don't know if it's solvable. That's a lot of, uh, you know, a lot of physics. Uh, it might check for the coordinates of the bumper versus the Roomba, but it doesn't, it doesn't work because take a look at this one. If I bounce there, that's normal. That seems normal. Well, no, because you're hitting the corner, so it's again turning it like it's a like. But it's if a, I hit you're hitting a circle. there, that doesn't make any sense. No. But it's the same collision point. But if you consider them circles, or you make them circles, then it will make sense, and then you don't have to figure out all the complex math and algebra. <laughs> you just need to make them circles. Well, you can almost assume that's a circle in Atari Land. I don't know. That's I don't know if you can make, as good as easily a... make circles in Atari Land or not, as far as background. But mm, I know not. Field. I know not these things. <laughs> I know not these things. Yeah, playfield. Uh... It's a bit rough. Yeah. <laughs> it's a bit rough going. Yeah, I. Uh, but yeah, if you assume it's a circle, then it. Then it. Then as far as I'm concerned, it's functioning it's just function. fine. Yeah. yeah, that's true. Yep. Are the bumpers square or circular? There's the big question. Yeah. If they're circular. If they're circular. It works. It's, it's working perfectly. Yeah. If it's a square, it's it's not. Yeah. So if you just have all you have to do is say they're circles. Yeah. They're perfect circles. Yeah. Uh. You, you need the tangent of the object you're hitting, as Tanya is saying. Yeah. Is that what you said? Sure. <laughs> yeah, sure. We'll, we'll go with that. Yeah. Okay. We're done with this, I think. Um, it's 
it's great. Yeah. Physics aside, because that's a complex answer to get that right. Um, because it depends on where you're hitting and yeah. Um, the friction is good, what he's added. And I think having not everything kill you adds a lot to the game. Just having the outside kill you. Yes. I like that. And that I do like that. And the yeah. inside being bumpers. It adds yeah. a lot of weird new yeah. tactics. Yeah, yeah, I like it. Of me- momentum tactics. I look I look forward to this game when we have our next um, multiplayer nights, our yes. next uh, um, That's gonna be fundraiser the qu- or whatever. Tari or Quatari. Night. Ooh. That's gonna be the multiplayer night. Yes. So I've been starting to get lists together. So Quatari stuff. Excellent. I mean this is not a Quatari, but multiplayer games. Like Yeah. One on one or four player at once yeah. games. Mm-hmm. And this is a very good contender. The font. Did you discuss the font on the plus? Oh, yes, that's right. Uh, I did not discuss that, but that I was going to put it on the uh, agenda. On the last show, remember there was a discussion about the font on the plus card. And Andrew David was saying there should be a space in between those letters. Remember? Mm. Um, but And we said, oh, there's a thin line. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's a space. But no, that's not what it was supposed to look like. It was supposed to be like a proper space. And I did some tests for Andrew because he sent me the ROM. Or he posted the ROM mm-hmm. for his character font set. And I was able to run it on uh, Stella. And then also run it on um, Harmony Cart as well and to test out my 2600 so I, p- I plugged it in and on the Stella it looked nice it's all spaced out and put it on the harmony cart and it looked all nice and spaced out so I started replying no oh, it looks looks great and but it didn't look didn't look like what happened last night or the Tuesday night and and then I was replying and then all of a sudden the 2600 starts going like crazy like things are starting to shift um, like when we did PESCO, I don't mm-hmm. know if you saw those things phasing in, those little dots. Yeah. Um, and then eventually it settled and some letters were together, some letters were apart, half of some letters were skewed on the top. It was, it was a big mess. Mm-hmm. So there's something wrong with that Atari. Oh no. <laughs> and there's been now multiple programs that have proven that. Mm. PESCO. Omega Matrix's menu mm. with those flags. Yes. Uh, the color timing. Oh, we're slightly off, yeah. Yeah. And now Andrew Davies' uh, font test. Oh, okay. Also is showing that there's um, timing issues and it's a warm up issue. They're all fine. Well, some of them are not fine. Pesco's mm. fine at the beginning and then it goes bad. And um, Andrew Davies' thing is fine at the beginning and then it goes bad. Um, some people said, oh, it's a TIA. Um, which is the video chip in it. And some are like, uh, well, it actually might be the Atari 20, uh, the RGB chip in it mm. that is making it. And it could be either. Yeah. It could be both combining together to yeah. make it worse. Yeah. So that's, yeah. The pixel shifting issue is probably caused by a combo of the TIA yeah. and RGB mod yeah. propagation delays. Mm-hmm. So the TIA could be bad. And then on top of that, the RGB is adding a slight bit more timing issues. Mm-hmm. Um, so how to solve that? I could replace the TIA in it. Mm. It is socketed because there is an RGB chip in it. Um, and take it out of a known good Atari that I can run all these tests on. And go bloop. And then that may or may not solve some or all or none of the problems. Mm. Yeah. So anyway... It just points out that this 2600 that we are playing on is not perfect. Mm -hmm. On certain, certain cases, it is not working. Um, Not very many right now, but the font on the plus card is kind kind of a big one because you're navigating and using it a lot. So that's a bit disappointing that this is not working well. I mean, it's it's gorgeous. Mm -hmm. The output is beautiful because of the RGB. But if there's going to be pixels that are moving around and off center it's not going to be the best representation Mm. for showing other people's games anyway enough with that Mm. Uh, um so we're going to move on to the next game falling asleep 
<laughs> no, Fine I'm sleep. reading the chat. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was reading Captain Classic's comment about actually it matters the center of mass on circles, and he's right because if it's heading straight on, it'll bounce straight back. But if you clip it, it will actually also bounce. bounce. Oh, yeah. So, so that's, that's true. Right. I mean, if, if it's a small pole in a large mass, then you can kind of get away with it just bouncing straight back. Like, like the size of, of the object you're hitting. Yeah. Um, but yeah, the center of mass and they have to be aligned for them to bounce back. If they're hitting from the side, then that's a different, that's different. So, yeah. Yeah. So, so it's still, physics is it's hard. still complex. There you go. Yeah, it's still complex. So uh, we're going to get into high score club yeah. games now, yeah. which there are three. So we're going to go for high scores. We've played these games before. We're not going, we're not explaining them. They're not updates. Well, yeah. Some of them are updates, actually. Um, so the high score club has been running since April 2nd, 2004. So 16 and a half years this has been going for. Mm. So they've covered a lot of games, but usually it's normal Atari 2600 games. Mm -hmm. um like old school and i think once a year they throw in some homebrews and somebody alerted me saying hey they're playing homebrews Yay! you're a homebrew show yeah. <laughs> you should play these games excellent and i'm like yes definitely um it looks like it was originally ran by uh zero with the underscore in the middle then vocelli vocelli how do you say that it's italian right vocelli vocelli and, and then S. Baz, and then Vocelli again. And Vocelli is in the chat, nice. or maybe not in the chat. <laughs> uh, he was in the chat in the beginning. Yeah. Coming up with own game, idea, own game ideas is not easy, no. Does anyone have any advice on where to find simple indie games, like old Flash games or simple homebrews, to port to the 2600? That's a good question. I mean, you could look on um, any apps, like ios apps or android apps and look in the game section there's lots of simple because usually they're one they're usually pretty simple yeah one button yeah. or tilting or like simple yeah. controls yeah, yeah which yeah. makes them simple games yeah. too um that's a great way to look at them yeah. look for them or flash games as well which have they're all gone because mm. <laughs> flash Aww, is deprecated flash. yeah yeah flash. back in the day Okay, the first game we're going to be playing is Miss Galactopus mm. uh, by Rick Pryor, Akari Yojimbo. Uh, first came out in 2016, and this build is new because he discovered a problem with the bonus mm. in his game by so many people playing it in the High Score Club. This was released on cartridge too, this game. Oh, and nobody wow. noticed this crazy high scoring bonus bug. Okay. That gave you tons of points all of a sudden. And he got rid of it, is what you're saying? He he, he thinks he's corrected it. Oh, so no <laughs> more much... high-scoring bonuses for us. Yeah, well, it's the same with the other people, too. Yeah. I think after 20,000, mm. it started getting a little crazy because of... Well, I'll read it out later. Um, so we have to be on uh, left difficulty B, right difficulty B, uh, game mode 1. So if you can load it up... Mm. Uh, and, and then we're trying for, uh, some high scores here. The top score is by McAllister. Oh, okay. Which is a, a, known, a, name we've a known name, yeah, Alain yeah. McAllister, who pops in from time to time. Yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Uh, 36,840. Uh, good luck to us. 36,000. Uh -huh. 36,000. 36. Um, so I'll give you a quick rundown. Of this game, have you yeah, played this? Yeah, I have, but I can't remember. It's a while ago. Yeah, yeah. Last time we played it was January eleventh, two thousand nineteen. Okay. So almost two years ago. So okay. I don't blame you. It might have been even longer for you. Okay. Um, in this level, you shoot the big octopus. Okay. And every time you shoot the big octopus, it goes up the screen a little bit, and you hit enough, you get past the stage. The little baby octopuses will be shot down. Okay. To distract you and get in the way. You also have to shoot them. You have to shoot everything, basically. Shoot everything, but your main goal is, is to, to get as many shots on the on the yeah. mother octopus. Okay. And then it gets to the next wave, which is a bunch of baby octopuses, and you just shoot them. Shoot everything. Okay. But this is the only one that's kind of a unique wave where you have to shoot the mother octopus. And your bullets reset. So, oh. Which is good and bad. So shoot the mother octopus. There you go. Oh, don't let it touch the bottom. Oh. Yeah. See, you don't tell. You don't. Sorry. That's okay. I, I have to get used to the. <laughs> True. Oh my gosh, the weird. You go off to the side. 
Don't let it touch the button. You have to shoot those. No, I don't office. care. I'm trying to figure out the, the, the physics of it. It's 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 super strange. So right now on the first level, the the mother octopus is just going back and forth, very regular. So I have to shoot where the octopus will be. Yes. Okay. Yes. Yeah. That's. Now your shield is gone. I don't care. <laughs> I, I'm trying to figure out how it works. No love for her children. No. She's using them as human shields, octopus shields. There you you. Uh, yeah. Made it to the second level. That's fine. I'm not oh. going for points. I'm trying to figure out how it plays. Like. So, uh, in the high score club, if you're in first, if you get first place in the game, uh, you get 11 points. Uh, you get 10 points for finishing second to fifth place. So in first place, you only get a slight bit more than getting second place, but you obviously want to be, or second to fifth. And then sixth to 10th place, you get eight points. 11 to 20th, you get six points. And if you post a score, you get four points. So everybody gets four points uh, or more. So I don't know what high score I've gotten on this. Tanya, I don't care, O'Brien. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I don't care. I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. I'm don't trying care. to figure out how it plays. It's entirely unfair for you to... <laughs> I don't think I've played this. No? No. It's really good shooter. Yeah, I just... I don't think I have. I, I, The screen looks familiar. Maybe I've watched you play it before, but... You may have seen it, yeah. Because of the dynamic, like the different um, waves yeah. and the way that you have to shoot the thing that's kind of protected by a shield. You have to shoot it twice on this level, the babies. Yeah. Um, so uh, Kiryu Jimbo says, thanks for choosing Miss Galactopus for the high score club. I hope everyone enjoys playing it. <clears throat> uh, here's the gist. Stop Miss Galactopus and her brood from penetrating the earth defense shield, the blue line under your ship and destroying the earth. A set number of babies will attack, one at a time, each wave. Each time a baby hits the shield, it weakens. After five hits, the shield disappears, and then the next baby to get past you will reach the earth, and the game will end. Shooting Miss Galactopus moves her close to the top of the screen. Push her all the oh. way to the top to finish the wave. Okay. Do you want another go? Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> so Tanya's is two, eight, nine, no, five. No, no. I, disregard I, that I, one. I, <laughs> That's completely unfair. <laughs> Like, here, play a game you've never played before, and let's put it in the high score club. <laughs> Thank you. No problem. This is pretty much every every <laughs> Twitch stream we do. <laughs> That's the best score ever that you can do. And, um, and I think it, it does time out. So when he when she sends enough babies down, the wave is over. But you just don't get any bonus. Oh, so I no bonus. I have no to push bonus her up. There, yeah. Uh, okay. So you want to get bonus. So you every want time. to get bonus, yeah. So really, your main main objective is to shoot her. Yeah. So shooting Miss Galactopus is a hundred points. You get more points for her, and a baby is twenty-five. At the end of each wave, you'll get a bonus based on the amount of shield you have left, and the number of baby Galactopuses remaining. Tip, drive Miss Galactopus away as quickly as possible. The more babies left when you finish the wave, the bigger your bonus will be. Um, and then he's gave a bunch more tips. Okay, now that you've been playing for a few days, here's a more detailed breakdown of what's going on in Miss Galactopus. The end of... Oh, in the first level, the Miss Galactopus Yay! has 15 babies, and it takes five shots to drive her away. Each level after, she starts with one additional baby, and it takes one more shot to defeat her. The end of level bonus is 25 times the babies remaining times the shield remaining. So in theory, the maximum bonus for the first level is 1,875 points. 25 times 15 times 5. But in practice, you're probably not going to get more than 16, 1,625. Since I don't think it's possible to clear the stage shooting fewer than two babies. Giving you a total a score of 2,155 points. 500 points for shooting this G5 times. 30 points for shooting two babies. Since the number of babies increases one each level, the maximum number of bonus does go up a little, 125 points, but it also takes an extra shot to finish off Miss Galactopus as she gets harder. Level breakdown. Level one, Miss Galactopus moves all the way to the edge before changing directions, drops babies at regular intervals. 
Level two, Ms. Galacticopus changes directions randomly, drops babies at random intervals. Bonus stage. Uh, then, ba level three, babies take two hits to kill. Level four, Miss Galacticopus moves down if she reaches the edge of the screen three times without being shot. Uh, and then a bonus stage. Then number five, babies zigzag as they move down the screen. Uh, level six, Miss Galacticopus dodges your shots. Oh my god. Uh, really? then, a, then a bonus stage. Then level seven, if you hit a baby while it's still being carried by Miss G, it gains an extra hit point. Up to a maximum of four. Oh my god. So you don't want to hit the babies in the later stages accidentally while she still has them. Um, after that, Miss Galacticopus continues to start each wave closer uh, to the bottom of the screen and the number of babies increases, but nothing else changes. Uh, there was, And then the issue. There was an issue with bonuses in the higher levels, so that was a fix posted on Wednesday. He said, I've attached a new Miss Galacticopus ROM to this post. That should fix the bonus issue. I'll leave it up to Vocelli to decide what to do about the scores already posted. Thanks to Roger Poco and Alice Dare Campbell for bringing this to my attention. For those interested, here's what's going on. If what should have been the last baby in a stage hits the shield, mm. the baby counter would go to zero, but the level wouldn't end. Mm. The next time a baby was shot or crashed into the shield, the counter would roll around from zero to 255. This was a quick and dirty fix. I only had two bites left to work with, but so far it's holding up. Two bites. Wow. That was, that was some good programming. Uh... arena foot talking about with 20 copies oh it starts moving really fast which which card uh, i can't scroll uh. oh they're zigzagging can't scroll oh this game arena foot are you talking about this game for copies of the cart. Oh, there's only there's one person selling one of the 20 copies released. Is it you? <laughs> so let's see where you are right now in the rankings. Not, not very high, I'm sure. You are in second to last place. <laughs> There's some pretty crazy scores. Oh, I, I have no doubt. Yeah. Yeah, there are only 20 copies of the game released at 20, 2019 PRG. Ah. No bonuses. Yeah, I know someone willing to sell their one copy. Oh, okay, cool. Well, there you go. I wonder why... It flashes when the baby's on the same level as your ship. Because presumably, presumably, they're both just... Oh, maybe it's Batari Basic, and that's why it flashes, just in case. Oh, 45, 35. Nah. Eh. Good. I'm getting a drink. I'll okay. be back. Okay, <laughs> goodbye. It might help me. You never know. <laughs> My turn. There's some crazy scores on the board. Ah. That was pretty quick. That was pretty quick. Not too bad. This one, she's a bit more erratic. There we go. There we go. Better. Ah. Ah. Got to be careful in the higher levels not to shoot the babies. Oh, nice. Nice bonus. This is the uh, bonus wave. Oh, 
how the bonus wave works. Is you just you get normal points for the guys, or do you get a bonus? Like a bonus at the end of this? Oh yeah, you do get a bonus. Probably based on time? Don't know. <gasps> Damn it. Shoot them twice. Bonuses. So I think I just lost like two, two shields on the bottom there. Bonus wave. I'm always moving back to the center on the bonus wave because really if it's random, you should always move back to the center. Because it could be on either side. Alright, how's it going? Pretty good. So well, you're beating me already. It's all about nice the bonus. Shooting. Yeah, nice it is shooting. about the boot the, the bonus. You have to get the bonus every yeah. time, I think. I've already gone down on shield, so I'm that's okay. Sucks. Uh, can you Not get your really, shield back? You, that's at where all, all or the bonus no. no. That's where all the bonus is, is the shield. Is it? Yep. You don't get, you get bonus in the shield? I thought you got bonus yep. for pushing the, galact the Galacta. Get this everything. Galacta back. You get bonus for... Oh, how much shield you have left? Oh my god, I just lost another one. Yeah, when they start going zigzaggy, they're a lot more challenging. <sighs> to ensure you catch them. Nice. Nice. Oh, you're doing very well. It doesn't seem to matter that it hits you. You just have to stop no. it from hitting the shield. They're after your shield, yeah. not you. Those baby Galacticuses. <gasps> Damn it. Oh, never mind. This game is not going to be great. That's a lot of babies for one Galacticus. Oh, yeah. Some some animals oh, have, have like tons. Yeah. <laughs> thousands, tens of thousands yeah. of babies. Especially um, ocean creatures. Yeah, the chance of survival have, is very, having, very low. What just happened? I missed the bonus. I didn't kill her in, kill her in time. Mm. Useless. Ugh. Oh my god. Is she releasing when I hit the baby? There we go. Jeez, terrible. blooming you're down to your last level of shield i think so i think you only get five so should have got that one. Oh, yeah you have to be right underneath them too come on Got away again. Yeah. No bonus. Ah, so end of level bonus is 25 times babies remaining times shield level. Yeah, so shield Gotcha. Is so if you have your huge. full sh shield, then you get a lot more bonus. Huge of course, bonus. you have to get Miss Galactopus in the first N place. And I haven't been, so, uh, so <laughs> it really didn't matter anyway. Yeah. <laughs> the key is getting her. She's quite... Uh, Challenging to hit sometimes. Oh, she's dodging now. So you have to kind of trap her almost. Yeah, to one side or the other. Which I've been... Yeah. <gasps> 11, 8, 4, 5. Not good at all. Mm. 
This one was nominated for two different Atari Awards. Oh, mm. I had that in my notes and I didn't say it. Mm. Best Sound and Music and Best 4K Homebrew. It's nominated mm. for last year's Atari Awards. Nice. Atari Homebrew Awards. I can do way better than that. Way, way better. So how did I place? Not good. I'm guessing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, ninth place. Ninth place? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ninth place. Um, that's, I said top ten. I said low top ten. <laughs> so I know I can do better than that. So I think I can move up. Oh yeah, that's At a decent bonus. two rankings on that. Uh, yep, they're both on B. Yep. My tactic was making sure to get her She's pretty as dodgy. she comes away from the edge because it, yeah. there's only she has one direction. Else, yeah, she yeah. has nowhere else to go. But Nice. Yeah, this is um, what was it? the game we're playing the other day, Stratavox. Very similar in the fact that you're doing sharpshooting, really. Mm. You're, you're aiming for a very, very small slice. And in Stratavox, that's what you're doing too. There's things at the top of the screen moving around and they came closer down. And you had to time it up, your shot with, with the shot with them. So very similar uh, gameplay in that respect. Good job. Kiryu Jimbo added the laurels to the label afterwards. Was there a cartridge released with those laurels on it? I saw the graphic uh, that he posted with the laurels and he made one up as well. He made up a best cephalopod. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> yeah, best cephalopod 2019 or something. Cause I saw the uh, label on the cartridge and it had three awards and I'm like what is that third award and the the type the, the um the graphics are so small I I couldn't really make it out I could see the other two awards were like oh yeah those are the ones he got nominated for but the third one was like I can't I can't read that what is that and it was like a long word and I was like oh best cephalopods yeah. <laughs> that was good nine <sighs> Yeah, I got ninth. No, not fourth place. Because I only got uh, 11,840 unless they discounted all those. There's tons of scores. 36,000, 24,000, 19, 16, 16, 16, 14, 13. Is it for this year or is it for previous years or anything like that? Because don't they no. have multiple years of it? They do, but they change games. They haven't played this game before, as far as I know. I, I'm not... I mean, I could be fourth place if I try really hard, but I'm not yet. Eighth place. That's from all seasons? So they played this before? Oh, that's weird. Let me check that out. Why would they post all? Oh, I felt I was doing well. No bonus. Galacticus. Galacticus scores. Really? Well, where's that list? No. Why would why would he? Current season. That's from all seasons. Current season, you placed fourth. Oh well. Well, where's that list? And why is that other all seasons list up there? <sighs> Why would he post all seasons list? I guess just to have it. Let's see. Oh yeah, I guess there's not too many people posting their Miss Galactopus scores. Let's see. Yeah, one's one is nineteen thousand. Yeah. There's oh. the 
There's the 16,000. There's an 11, 3, 6, 3, 2, 5. That one's up there. Hmm. Current season link above. Yeah, that's the one I'm looking on. Oh, come on! Yeah! <laughs> oh, I a destroyed... Bit of a bonus. Oh, you get a bit of your shield back. Are you sure? I just got a bit of my shield back. The color changed. Oh, maybe at a certain score you get some? Ah! Well, oh. so much for that. Five zero. Well, I'll take fourth, but I still don't believe you. Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm seeing a lot of scores. Seventy-six hundred. Eight two. Well, maybe I can't find all of them. Interesting. No, like where where's the list that you're seeing? Because right now I see a list with like 20 people on it. And it goes from 36,000 points to 3,000 points. Um, that is the link I'm on. And right above my score is Oyama family or what score did I get? Scrolled off the screen. Game never played in High Score Club. Yeah, so I think Captain Classic, you are mistaken. Oh! Oh! What happened? What happened? I don't know. It, it your... circled through. I think something uh, glitchy happened. You weren't paying attention, though. No. It but like, it like rounded around it? the bottom. I think I should have died. Oh, like the baby went through yeah. the bottom? And then came back through the top. Oh. Okay. <laughs> it was like, bonus. <laughs> well, we can uh, get a replay on that later. <laughs> Anyone else see that? I saw that. <laughs> I, I don't think I should be... Uh, not that I mind, because my score's not so bad, but... Well, this is the fixed version. <laughs> oh, almost. Yeah, like, you're on... I don't know what level you're on, but... You're... I'm doing not bad. You're doing very well. No I bonus. got a lot of bonus on the last bonus round, but um, no, that was weird. If anyone else was paying attention, my husband wasn't, so. <laughs> You're not letting your shots go. Oh, okay, there you go. No, I wasn't. I was looking at scores, trying to. It's always that's always when uh, <laughs> something happens. Is when you're looking at. Scores. Looking away. Yep. Or you're trying to read the chat. <laughs> yep. Yep. Something exciting happens, but it's all recorded, so it's all good. Oh, I read you wrong in the chat. Your score wrong. Oh, that's why. Okay, you're. That's why it didn't make any I thought sense. Thought it was one hundred and ten thousand. <laughs> <laughs> well, I would have been dominating, way far. Yeah. Nice. Ah. Oh, that good wasn't score. bad though. That wasn't a bad score. Ten thousand two twenty. So what are just below me? I could do 10, that again. I could I could exceed that too. I, I don't yep, think it was. You just beat twenty six hundred. So you're just nice. below D teacher. Good stuff. Nice. Oh, hello. Hello Atari. Hello, Atari. Are you here to to attack um cephal cephalopods? Come here. Oh he would if he could. Oh he would. He would attack whatever he could find. There he is. Say hello, sir. Your adoring public. You're gonna sit and purr. He's here for moral support. Yeah. Yeah, buddy. For his moral support. <laughs> <laughs> He's here to get pets. Huh? He's here to get pets. It's a great game. It is. It's such a good, like, simple concept shooter. Like, yeah. 
but it's also it's got a there lot are of not enough games with octopuses no um <laughs> and octopuses with lipstick and bows in their head yes i would say hair but they don't really have <laughs> in, a, in their head they're pretty awesome attached to their head with a a vaguely galaga shit shooting at them yep. so yeah which is always good mm -hmm. these guys are awfully low why are they so low to push them back sooner you hit them the faster you hit them the further back they start yep yep mm. good job not bad I just do not want my shield oh my god I almost forgot to hit them twice oh come on yes Nice. Nice. A little bit of bonus Very at good. least. Yay, Atari. Not much, but a little. Yay. Yay, Yay buddy. Nice. No one mentioned my baby spot my baby spider, my baby, baby spider. octopus uh, looping looping around. No. Maybe they didn't see it. It was uh it definitely happened. <laughs> it definitely I happened. didn't I didn't hallucinate it. Nobody saw it. Didn't didn't happen. It was very unusual. It was almost like it's like we'll let this one go. <laughs> <laughs> we'll let this one go. You can keep playing. Nice. Oh good job. Yeah, the bonuses make all the difference. Yeah, that's where all the points come in. Like mm. huge amount of points. Mm -hmm. But it's ra like the game is random, so mm -hmm. there is a bit of chance and luck to this game. Mm -hmm. It's like, will the octopus turn around? Will it not? We were checking the AA forum page when that happened, Tanya. <laughs> Thanks, Arena Foot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's disconnecting. What is? Uh, the chat. Is Your it? laptop oh, is disconnecting, no. so we're missing. Atari cat. Oh no. Oh, missed cat things. Yeah. I figure you should play any game at least five times before you give up. Most games take anywhere between five to ten plays before you hit your your first plateau. Yeah, that's so true. Yeah. 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 Oh, so missed a whole bunch. We missed a whole bunch. Um my laptop, which is what we used to read the chat off of. I think it's the routers, though. Some, yeah, no, no, I think you're right. <sighs> oh no, sometimes it seems to randomly disconnect, and then all of a sudden it'll say "Welcome to the chat room," and it's like, wait a second. So we we missed a bunch there. That little that makes sense. That guy went off the edge that time. Did that yes. what he did on the left kind right hand of side? Kind of went off the edge. And he might have missed the blue, which may be the indicator. No, too. but I had no blue. I had a black. Oh. So I, it was black, and it I should have away. died. Do you God know what I mean? It. And I didn't die. That was very right. strange. Yeah. Twitch is acting up tonight. Mm. Sorry about that. It's just the... Um, it's our router, though. Our... Well, yeah. Yeah, it's just the, in the, the chat. Because in the stream, it's there. My it's, computer's hardwired. There's stuff there, but that's okay. The funniest part sometimes is the chat, so... Yes. Yeah. I couldn't get my phone to stream the video. It was audio only. Same issue I had in the past. Yeah. Well, it is Friday night. I don't know. It's Friday night. Hazy, smoky, people's asthma's acting up. They're home playing video games. I don't Maybe. know. <laughs> no! Uh, yeah. Uh, no bonus. Come on. No! Squirrely little buggers. I don't think it took away my shield. I think it did. I don't think it, I think it ran there. away before. Uh, well, that's yeah. kind of a good thing. I'll take that rather than a loss of shield. End of a round, because it was going to end anyway. We will go. We will look at the video and clip it out. And <laughs> 
um, or, or, or post Yours? what post what the time was when it happened because uh, definitely something weird happened. I should have died. Mm. I mean, I was I was already at ten, not ten thousand close to it, but um, my score or nine, I think my score was pretty high. But I should have died when I didn't, which was a little bit odd. Doing good, doing good. Mm. Mm. Not getting the bonuses. Come on the level where if you shoot the baby before he descends, you, it, it uh, gets mm. more powerful. Oh, oh my no. god. Oh. Terrible. Mistakes were made. <laughs> 1280. Okay. Not, it's better. Not much better. Yeah. Am I getting one more shot? One more shot? Oh, yes. Oh, yes, more than yes, that? Yes, okay, yes, good. Yes, yes. good. I good. feel I have not... Not reached your, your no. plateau yet. I yeah. should get 15. Yeah, okay. Thank you very much, Arena Foot. Yeah, well, it's a good bonus yeah. in the beginning of the game. Yeah, it gets a get. lot harder as it goes on. But yeah, it's just because it gets so much harder to hit the the big octopus. It just becomes more octopus. sporadic in yeah. her movement. Really good enemy movement in this game. Oh, I love it. Yeah. That's that's. And then it really gets challenging when they start kind of the babies come down all erratically. So you have like to zigzagging. really pay attention to them at that point. And they're faster, I think. They come down faster, too. Nice. Good bonus. Yeah. Good bonus. Not bad. Only 15 points. Then you get bonus for getting them really fast. Hi, kitties. Oh, my. When they're really far away. Ugh. Oh, yeah. it's brutal. And then right they start getting the fast screen. and they, they, they kill your shield. Oh, they are going fast. Yeah, they go faster. So if you don't repel them... Oh my god, I've never gotten them this fast. Usually you're able to repel them. but That's just bonus. But, no, but here's the thing. When uh, when they're, they randomly end up really far apart from each other... I forgot that was two shots. <laughs> I do two every time. But you didn't lose anything, so... Yeah, when they're far apart, you don't have a chance to... Well, like, it's... I played one bonus, and they were all, like, next to each other, and I, I, I got a really good bonus off of it, because it was just pure luck. Really. Yep. A lot of luck in this game. I mean, obviously skill, too, but... You have to counteract that luck with skill. Is there another cat there? Too hot for slippers. Why am I wearing slippers? Oh my I goodness. I do not know. Ugh. Ran away. I know. I, I we stopped got some my bonus. shots. That's weird. Probably from the shield? I don't know. I don't know. I thought you don't get any bonus when they run away. Oh, it's only 1080p today. So people with slow... That is so weird to me that Twitch is... Why wouldn't they want it at a lower oh. rate? Why wouldn't they give you that option? Right? Yeah. Why is that a bonus for being high up on Twitch? Do you think... I guess they want to show the quality the best? But why wouldn't they give an option? Anyway, that's something that you can only get when you're partner. And you can only make partner <laughs> if you have, on average, 75 viewers. On, on average. average. Which is quite a few. <laughs> and I'm not playing Fortnite, so I'm not getting 75 people per, on average. Mm. 
Yeah, right now I'm streaming at uh, 2 megabits per second. Um, I did drop it to 1500 when we were having issues before. That's a good bonus. Well, it, you get lucky. <laughs> yeah, that was a lucky one. Um, but we used to stream at three, 3 megabits per second. But I found that 2 is fine, fine enough. And it's better to do it low than to do it high because just like uh, Arena Foot has trouble, you would have a lot more trouble at 3 megabits per second mm. than 2. Oh, come on. The YouTube one um, that I upload is way, 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 way higher bandwidth because I record it locally and then upload it to YouTube after. Oh, oh my god. Have you calculated your average before? Uh, yes, I do. I get my average at the end of every episode and it keeps a running total. Um, and I think you guys can see how many people are watching at all times as well um, through the through the site. On a really, really good day, it can get between 40 and 50 people watching Yeah. at a good time on a good day. When, 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 yeah. When got... there's a big game that everybody wants to see or something exciting that I'm premiering. Something new. Yeah. Or a, Brazil or a Brazilian game. <laughs> <laughs> the Brazilians come out in support. That is for sure. They are very happy when I play Brazilian games. Um, yeah, it, but you have to sustain 75 on average. That means I have to be over 75 yeah. at points. It's terrible. To make up for the under 75 of yeah. points. Whoa. A new champ game. Yeah, a new champ game, exactly. Exactly. Every day. Yeah. And that's <laughs> for a month. And I have to maintain hard. that. Yeah. Average is... What is the average usually? 30? Or is that max? Mm, max 30 to 40 higher. is max. Max is usually around 40. Um, average is... No, max is much... Is average it? is like mid twenties to thirty sometimes. It, uh, no, I thought I thought average is usually difference. thirty to forty, and then then you get like total viewers, which is a lot higher. But um. Oh, total viewers is huge. That's that's nothing to do with average. People popping in and out. And, yeah. Hundreds, <laughs> hundreds of people actually watch it, yeah. but they don't watch the whole thing yeah. because it's a long stream, <laughs> 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 and people don't have three or four hours mm. to put aside. So they they pop in and out. They see yeah. it. A lot of people watch it on YouTube after, which does not count towards Twitch, oh, obviously. Oh, no, of course not. Twitch does not care about YouTube. No. They don't want YouTube. That's their rival, in fact. Oh, that's good. There we go. That's a good one. Captain Class, I think I regularly see about 20 to 30 on average. So we all need to spam Zero Page Homebrew upcoming streams and all social media. <laughs> Maybe good or bad, depending on how nice they are to you spamming them. Yeah. <laughs> or VCS will have to make a huge comeback, even with the Switch and PS5. <laughs> that's right. Everybody be sick of all the new systems. Yeah, that's like, right. They're way too expensive. Get we an can old just... school retro uh, That's right. We can get a 2600 for 25 bucks. And it can connect to the internet. <laughs> that's right. It has internet capabilities yeah. now. No, oh, I no. want to start over. That's rage reset. Oh, I actually do. <laughs> oh no, it's pointless. It's pointless. Uh, I'm not going to get the scores because that just took me down like yeah. massive amount. Miss Command said I used to only watch YouTube before I investigated the Twitch app. Well, yeah, exactly. Rage reset. Me too. <laughs> uh, yeah, same here. I mean, well, that was a good one. Yeah. Rage reset. <laughs> so there's lots of good streams on on twitch not mm. not 2600 streams it's only mm. like a couple mm. there's all kinds of things not just gaming too so oh uh, yeah mostly gaming because that's what it started out as no pull tonight no no, no uh next next time because i'll be playing um uh, high score like um, patch game mm. next time so I'll need to know which patch after that I need to do I'm going to be doing astronomer mm. so good luck to me 
Oh, You've done it a few times and it's hard. so challenging. 12 is my top score out of 20. Good job. Yeah, they're a little far apart, but mm. some bonus. No, you, as long as you get something. Yep. Sometimes you get lucky and sometimes you don't with a bonus. You just don't know what direction the octopus is going and you kind of just shoot and then if it's not going to make it, you shoot again. Oh, uh, Mr. Vicelli says anyone who wants their game played in the HSC next season can reach out to me in AA. Oh, nice. That's there you go. Cool. So all you homebrew developers. Yes. Want to get their game uh, featured, which is uh, a really, there's a, little, a lot of people play the games in the high score club. Mm. So it's very good exposure. It's a fun thing to do. And you'll find all the bugs in your game. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's true. <laughs> All the people playing it and giving feedback because they're pushing the game to the limit, right? Because uh, people may just play casually otherwise. The game's like, oh, it's fun, you know? These people are like, no, we're getting the most out of this game. We're going to try and find all the point scumming ways to get the high score. Mm -hmm. Dan ABC says, I only watch two streams on Twitch, this one and one on Mondays from a local arcade. That actually oh, sounds yeah. pretty cool. Oh, what do they do on, like... Like, what do they do? They talk about arcade games yeah. or like it's actually in an arcade? That'd be really we, cool if they talk about arcade games. Go ahead. No, I was going to say we should do a live stream from our local arcade when uh, at some point. That'd be very interesting. It would be fun. I don't know what. We would just talk to him, I guess. I think he would be all for it. <laughs> oh, 100%. <laughs> yeah. The, the dude who runs it is really, really nice I think nice I made guy. enough of an impression on him. Yeah. That he would remember. <laughs> He'd be like, oh, yeah, okay. Well, we, we held the uh, Satan's Hollow High score for a, for a while. while. Probably still there. That's probably. I don't know. I Depends how popular second Satan's second Hollow right? is. Second, right? Or first? I think so. Second and third or something. Second I don't know. No, first. I think you had first. Yeah. You, did, you got a pretty good high score there. Um... He has a nice scrolling screen where it shows everyone's high scores oh, and their, yeah. and their um, initials and the whole thing. Yeah, just look for ZPH. Yes. <gasps> no! I thought I got him and then I went back I went back to the main octopus. I'll, I won't wait for you, Dodged my bullet. Yes. Yes. Nice. Nice. One more, right? Oh. Um, oh. They show preview of new games that it's go that are going to be showed. I guess. Oh, that's cool. Galloping Ghost Arcade. Ooh. Oh, I've heard of that. That's a big, uh, big, Is there big, big name there arcade. Is there a big one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. Oh, oh um, my God. Oh. Sorry, neighbors. Yeah, Captain Classic. When H HSC finds a way to point scum, we sometimes change the way we keep score. Mm. Well, of uh, course. I think yeah. that might have to be done. For Cosmic Art, uh, Time oh. Pilot, and Popeye. Yeah. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, there's certain games where you don't play them properly. Oh, Arena Foot. FYI, James Tanny, I found a programmer to port my Mardi Gras video game to oh. the Intellivision last night. Or oh, INTV, nice. Suggested by Grey Defender. Very oh, cool. very cool. Very cool. Yeah, Danny MC said a few weeks ago they showed uh, R360 Arcade at Galloping Ghost Arcade. Uh, R360. Yeah. I don't know that. Mm. Does that stand for something? I don't know. <laughs> like when yeah, you it's hit nice the... to hear about streams that are out there too because they, they can be hard to find sometimes. Yeah. It's a little overwhelming, especially if you're like, I like this game and there's like mm -hmm. thousands of streamers. And their categories are not good. Like you, not you, always. There no. is no retro category. There's no homebrew category because yeah. they don't care. There's no really retro category. There's a game called retro, and there's everybody that plays retro games labels themselves as this retro game, which I do too, because that's all there is. How else are you supposed to find? Yeah, old? The, for the broad categories. Yeah, because yeah. it's all new games. They focus only on new games. Fo yeah, mainly. they don't care about. Yeah. Miss Command was just saying we had a new one pop up in downtown arcade reboot. From their art, it looks like classic games, but not been able to make it yet. If you don't mind oh. me asking, what city are you in? A, a larger city, or is it a smaller, smaller place? 
because whenever we travel, not that we're going to be traveling anytime soon. But we go down the West Coast. We go down the West Coast a lot, and then sometimes we're down out east. Damn it! Oh, no. oh. sorry. Do you have distractions? Okay. I always like to hear where the arcades are. <laughs> yeah, I mean, we go to Las Vegas, too. Yeah. Uh, oh, the Miami. Pinball, the pinball museum there was pretty cool. What the hell? Winston-Salem. Oh, okay. Massachusetts? Nice. Where's Winston-Salem? There's a lot of Salems. Isn't there in the U.S.? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe Winston Salem. I thought Massachusetts uh, automatically. So uh, twelve five hundred. That is not good North enough. North Carolina. Okay. Can I play one more? North Carolina. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead. Um, yeah, it's always fun to find them. The the arcade in Portland's amazing, and I and we were there for the last retro gaming expo, which would have been twenty nineteen, and I think it was the first time we had actually. Yeah. Been or the first or second time we'd actually gone there and we're like how have we not gone here before we'd this heard is about ridiculous. it so many times we'd heard about it but we never had time to go because we were concentrating on the the the, the, expo. the show but that that arcade is it's amazing quite good. it's huge it has enough and, it's, and retro it has a really games. nice ambiance and multiple bars and it's just really neat because it had uh start? What, was was I press start? what is it something um, like that i can't remember press start press start no no I can't. I, anyway. Everybody knows what it is. Yeah, the, the big one in, in Portland. Yeah. yeah. Um, it had Dig Dug. I was playing a lot of yeah. Dig Dug there. Baby Pac-Man we played a bit. Yeah, Baby Pac-Man's cool. We played some pinball. Play a lot of. Burger Time we played. Because that's when... Um, that's when the homebrew was coming, came out a bit. Yeah. Around that time. What? 768 arcade games? Oh my god. That's. Galloping uh, Ghost is Brookfield, Illinois. Mm. Oh my god. What else is in Illinois? Chicago. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's um, something. I don't think I've been. I haven't been to Chicago. I've been, I've been to a few, few cities on the East Coast. Not a lot in the center. No. Not a lot in the center and not a lot down south. Been to Texas. We've been... I haven't been to Texas. You've been to Texas. We've been to Florida. Um, I mean, I, I traveled when I was very young down to Virginia and uh, Florida. Come on. But yeah, not a lot. Not, uh, and I've been to Florida many... Uh, Many times, but not. Lilla Pajankin Panau is now following. Yay! <laughs> Sorry, I'm going to mangle. Panau, yeah, you'd man mangle that. I'm going to mangle it every time. There's no way I can me memorize uh, the Swedish pronunciation. You can figure it out. You're just going to have to practice. You know who I'm talking about. Yeah, I do. <laughs> Be easier to memorize uh, his real name. Yeah, I like I like finding the arcades. Nice. Yes, 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 yes. Yes. Hell yeah. And it's always nice for games to have like a bonus round. Where it breaks up the, yeah. the gameplay. Oh my god, get out of the way. There we go. Oh, oh no. I sacrifice my shield to get him. Of course. Yeah, they're they're wily when they start going zigzagging on Come on. Nice. Gets a lot harder to hit her when <laughs> in the upper so levels. So much harder. Yeah. The bonus is so almost unachievable. And she gets higher on the screen as you hit her. So it's harder to time it, right? Oh my god, nice. I got it. Nice. That should be good. Oh. Good. Uh, that was fine. Yeah. Shinobi had the best bonus screen, or Galaga, which I bet is James's favorite. Yes, it's hard to get the bonuses on Galaga. It is very difficult. Like the first one, maybe, but the ones afterwards, forget it. Not. 
great on Galaga. I just love playing it. <laughs> I enjoy playing it. Well, you're not terrible either. Not but terrible. It's, it is a challenging game. It is memorizing patterns. movements and patterns. Yeah, it is a lot of pattern and, memorization. Uh... Oh my god, I haven't hit her once. No bonus for me. No, oh, I hit that bloody thing so many times. Come on. Oh, almost hit it again. Oh! Memorization and double ships, yes. Yep. I always shoot my, my ship. I always shoot my <laughs> ship. Without failure. Ugh. Come on. Need some good points in this bonus round. Ugh. I mean, at least you get score for it, but still. Sadness. Oh, for shooting your own ship? Yeah. yeah a little bit. Not to make up for it. Not One more. Come on. Oh, almost to the top. Come on. Oh. No, because the further down he comes before you hit him. Oh, he's speeding up now. Yeah, because... Oh, just in time. Just in time. Oh, now he's building no. up. No, because you hit him once, I now know. you have to hit him three times. I know, you don't he's building hit him. up. You can build up to four times. Really? <gasps> oh, last, last shield. On. Oh, oh she God. dodges so you. So dodgy. Ugh. Ah, hit him twice. She is really dodgy now. I don't know how you're supposed to get She's her. She's evolving. Top levels. Probably her... Nice. Oh, they get darker. You can see them when you hit them. Oh. Like blip. Oh, 10 point bonus. Thanks. Ugh, every time. Hit him. Nice. But it counts for nothing if you don't get the get, bonus. Get the whole thing. Well, you do get you you do get hundred for it. Yeah, or you do. But... So it's it's not nothing, but it's the bonus is really what you want. The only way I can get any points is here. Mm -hmm. And that's if I get a good uh, run. Like this. Some points! That's a good bonus. That's a very good bonus. You got him right up there really quick. Ah, now I just have to survive. Good luck. Don't hit him. Don't post other <laughs> streams in the stream. No, <laughs> no that's the Galloping Ghost yeah. one. <laughs> Fifteen seven fifty five. Yeah, pretty good. Pretty good. I know I can do better. You want to keep playing, or we have a couple more? To play? Uh, we'll keep going. <laughs> so we're going to the next game. Okay. Okay. That's not bad. Mm. And I may want to try for more. Um, I can revisit it before the end of the high score club. Yeah, actually, it was the thirteenth it was going to end on, but now it's the twentieth. Oh, they've, they've extended it. Yeah. So yeah. so we can always take another shot at yeah. it. Because this game, yeah. I, I like I Well, like I think you can, lot. and I think it's one where if you get a little bit of luck on your side, you can get a really high score. So. Seventh place. Yeah. 
Low not top ten. Bad. Not bad. I promise, low top I'm ten. I'm pretty happy with with that ten, even though I think something funny happened. Uh, I now I'm more so. I'm more interested that something funny happened. But um, but I would I would take another stab at it. It's a fun game. So the next game we're going to be playing is City, City Defense, Defense by Anthony Quinlan, aka Twenty Six Hundred. Um, left difficulty B, right difficulty B, expert game. Oh no, it's okay, Dan. It's fine. <laughs> James was just joking. Oh no, that's fine. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Totally fine. Totally fine. Uh, other streams, you would definitely be kicked. <laughs> oh, for posting. For posting. Yeah, but they're not posting live. Like they're. He's just saying yeah. that's the stream that. Yeah. No, it's all cool. Dan. No, 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 no. It's I all don't fine. Care. <laughs> okay, so the top score in this is 15,942. Uh, to get on the board, oh, you have to pick expert. Oh, okay. Yeah. So say that again. Start from the beginning. Um, do you, have you played this game? I think so. It's like Missile Command. Yeah. Little things coming down. You shoot your, sh your, your uh, bullet. Yep. And the bullet explodes. Yeah. And you want to cap <laughs> capture... The thing coming down in yeah, the explosion. in the explosion, yeah. Not, you're not shooting it. Do you shoot? Before it gets there. You shoot it and hit the button to make it explode? No. No. Just one shot, it'll explode where your target is. Because you move a target gotcha. around the screen. Yeah, that's right. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, BB for all the high score games. And this one has a, a built-in choice yeah. in the menu. Mm. Um, so, yes. Okay, do you want to make scoring? Um, the taller the building, they're really dark on here, but you can see them. Yep. Um, the taller the building, mm -hmm. the more points at the end of the round you get. If it's still there. Don't let Maybe them bomb that. Yeah, you have to protect it, right? Don't let them bomb those two things or I it's game over. I just something similar. I, I can't remember sure now. I'm pretty sure you have. I feel like I have. Yeah, you can't, you, they can't bomb the plant or it's... Or it's that. trouble, or you get, or your movement slows down, and yes, it's pretty much game over. Yes, that's it. Yeah, your it's, movement. It's I remember this now. It's game over if that happens. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's about it. Uh, yeah. Okay. I think I have played this before. What's What are the high score? What's the range like? To get on the board is 498. Okay. Um, to... mid, mids are 6,000. To Top 16. is 15. Okay. Hmm. Or 16-ish. It is hard. Uh, and this is a special ROM that was posted because it's hard. This is oh come on. Or, or, there's something changed about it. He didn't really explain what was changed about it. Yeah, what is, I, I it think, doesn't explode. There it explodes. No, it doesn't. There it explodes. No, it doesn't explode. It just hits. No. Oh, okay. You have to anticipate. I I I played okay. something s different. Okay. okay. Definitely different. Trackball support? No. Well, in joystick mode, <laughs> but not in trackball. Mode. Maybe I just played it on easy. I don't know. But it would be a perfect game for trackball support. That's for sure. Oh, that was a close one. Nope. <laughs> None of it's close. It's terrible. No, it came close to you. Exploding you. Got that one. <laughs> Some people are getting 60. The, all the points you get at the end of the round, really. Yeah. So you have to finish the round. Terrible! Oh my god, this is going to be a terrible game. <laughs> well, you're on the board. Oh, lord. Second to last. Next score you have to beat is... Oh, get that one in the middle. Oh. oh. I thought I hit it, but I... It, I... I score club. <laughs> oh, did people record it? No, you no, care? you don't. I... <laughs> Again, when you're playing a game for the first time, <laughs> I'm not counting on the high score. Uh, 2600 says, first and foremost, I'd like to thank the moderators for choosing my game to ran run this season. Miss Galactopus and Dog Gonnet are great games. Also, congrats to Rick Pryor and Armscar Coder for making the cut. As promised, I will give it, be giving some tips, and I'm sure the runners will find many more that I'm not aware of along the way. We'll change sides. Uh, to begin with, for those who prefer console reset over joystick fire, make sure to set the console to black and white mode. No, I don't like that. Uh, so the game can be only restarted by the reset console switch. A uh, piece of advice to note of point rewards for the remaining buildings at the end of each wave. Depending on the size of the building depends on the reward. So if you have two ICBMs about to destroy your buildings, you can only take out one. It's important to save the larger oh building. My God. Oh, now it's pain time. Oh, it's terrible to start with. You can't get them all on expert uh, 
No, anyway. you have to pick and choose. Oh, that's terrible. You're doing better already. Oh, no. Yeah, you're... No. No? No, it's oh. not going well. Okay. <laughs> I'm not timing them up well at all. The other oh, it's still slow! Oh, oh my forever. god, forget it! I just want to restart it. No, uh, no, you can't play it like this. Once that's gone. Takes away points once the missile hits the ground. Oh, yes. So you lose points. Well, from a total score. That makes sense. That makes sense. Yeah. Yeah. Not many games where you lose points usually accumulative not yeah they go down that's so de demoralizing <laughs> that you can literally go to zero i remember the early builds of this game where you lose if it goes to zero and it was so hard to start because you started at zero so if you let one thing go wrong the game was over um the other tip is to protect that power station if it gets taken out, your targeting system will only run at 50%, crippling your ability to venture out to the far reaches of the city. You can only shoot one at a time, too. Yes. Yeah. Which is horrible. You can't really get them all. No, you have to pick and choose. Oh, that one's going to your power station! Oh, it's too far! Oh, it's it, this is a terrible game. <laughs> <laughs> well, and, and the, um... This is, yeah, this is awful. Scar can go to zero when letting asteroids hit the planet in Astro Blast. Lower, Miss Command says. It's it's terrible because uh... Uh, the game runs off a month by month system per wave and season to season per year cycle. That means after three months waves, you enter the next season. It's important to note that if your power station gets taken out, you need to re re survive the rest of the season, so you can get it back after th three waves. When the next season changes over. So you on. Can't, you can't hit them. You can't, like. Oh, I'm dead. Wow. Yeah, no, I don't like this game. <laughs> it's <laughs> it's a pretty awful. Hard, hard <laughs> it's a pretty game. Awful game. Hard game. Not by. Not in the gameplay, but playing it on expert is just. Brutal. Is brutal. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna get on the board very high on this one. See, it's so easy to miss them, and then, yeah, see, if that was a few inch, a centimeter <laughs> over, you would have been pretty much dead for the game. Yeah, this is another anticipatory um, game where you have to... You have to know the exact physics and movement and how long it takes to get from one side of the screen to the other, uh, or you just completely screwed. Yeah. Yeah. Negative score. Yeah, if, Negative you don't hit, score. if, if you don't hit ah, any of them, didn't shoot. Yeah, it won't because you can't shoot multiple. It's pointless going for some sometimes. It's like, yeah, yeah too far away. You almost want to stay just where, right around your power station, because you'll be screwed if if it comes for your power station. Oh yeah. And it takes such a long time for the missile to get there too. Don't. <laughs> yeah. Tenure rage quit it. Yeah, I'm like, oh, this is rough. I'm like, done. Yeah. Done. <laughs> you play. <laughs> I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna become an expert at this game in a couple of plays. I can tell you that much. Yeah, you're getting better at it. You're you're hitting more of them now. It's 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 anticipation. Oh, oh see if that, that had close. hit you, you would have been dead. Yep. That one will. There you go. Good job. Barely. Barely got that one. Yeah, in Missile Command, you can send off multiple things. Yeah, that's the thing. Like, this is one at a time. Whoa. The guys that are launching his missiles want to know if they hit it first yet or not before they send off another one. They're like, did we hit it? Yep. Yeah, no. Okay, now we can reload. <laughs> What accounts for score difference, 20, 40, 60 for the bombs? Good That's question. a good question. Might be uh, how high they are in the sky. Maybe take a look at that. Hmm. Might be random. Flackets, let the missile destroy 95% of the cities at the beginning and then start playing. I guess it doesn't. Uh, oh. uh, and then you just protect your two your two buildings, I guess. 2, 2, 2, 8. Hmm. What did I get? Drop speed, Terrible. maybe. Yeah, the drop speed does change. Third to last. Yeah. I'll play one more. 
Yeah. I don't know if I'm going to get much better. It's so hard. Well, you this this strikes me as a game you have to practice a lot, a lot of. Yeah. Yeah, you don't get bonus if you let it destroy all the city. That's the problem. Yeah, but do many people get the bonus? Oh. On expert? Yeah. Like, it's pretty hard. Yeah, Almost game lucky. over there. This is a, a game where you can get game over very quickly. Yeah. Well, if it hits you, you're it. That's yeah. it. You're done. One life. Ah. That could have been coming for me, and I would have been dead. See, yeah, it's random. Those were beside each other. It was 20 and 40. See? Oof. I almost died. This yeah, game. it's definitely the speed. It's definitely the speed. Oh, the speed of them? Yeah. Oh, okay. That was a slow yeah. one. Yeah, it was 20. That makes sense. Because the fast ones are much harder. Like, that's harder. Yeah. If you want more points, go for the fast ones, but it's harder to get them, though. See, that's a 20, that's a 40. Oh, that was a nothing. <laughs> it just disappeared in a puff of smoke. <gasps> Funny. Sorry, citizens. You have a really <laughs> crappy missile defense. Oh, it's coming really close to you. No. Lucky. Very lucky. That one is going to kill me. Oh, it's not over. A little bit of a pause there. They had a tea break. Okay, I can get that other one. Now. Ah. Yeah, this would be much better with the uh, trackball. Yes. Still hard, but much, much easier. You don't move very fast, I find. Is it a new season? No, next one's a not new yet. season. Not yet. Yeah, you're almost there, though. It'll be daytime next one. Maybe. It's been so long since I played this game, I can't remember. Much about it. Oh my god. Nope. <laughs> I'll get you first. Closer ones. Nope. Not even close. Luckily, it's imprecise, which is something. Yeah. That you only have to be kind of near it. Kind of, but the, the blast wave is pretty... <gasps> oh, no. Terrible. Slow, but if the instructions are correct... The end of the season is coming. Yeah. Oh, why are they not targeting me now? Oh, I can't even catch up to that one. <laughs> no, you can't. You just have to... Stay low. Stay close. Okay. Oh, not yet. See, if I move over here, it's dangerous. Yeah. I'm not going to move too far. I can't. No. Because I can't get back to no. defend myself. Hey, it comes back. Yeah, it does come So back. even if you lose That's it at good. the very end of the season. That's kind of okay. Yeah. Now they'll be faster. Yay. Maybe I'll get into fifth to last place. Because I don't lose all my points. No, not again. <laughs> don't do it at the beginning of the season. Oh, no. Just be over. Just be a slow trudge to death. Oh, two for one. Nope. Oh, my God. I have to wait for that one to explode first. Oh, my God. It's so nerve-wracking when it's like two inches away from your, your base. Yeah. And if you miss, it's over. There's no lives in this game. No. <laughs> it's kind of a half-life mm -hmm. with with your station. Yeah, that's right. But there's no there's one life. That's that's it. Which is very unusual too. Ugh. Anticipate. Need to be much further out. Oh my god. But if they don't hit a building, you don't lose points. So I've got like four buildings left. I guess you lose if you lose all your buildings too. Like the bonuses I'm getting are going to be pathetic because mm. I have no buildings left. So all my points are getting from the 
from the bombs. Oh, I got that one? Oh my god. I don't think I'd get either of those. Nope. Ooh, that was lucky. Very lucky. Ooh. I think I'll concentrate on that one. Yeah. <laughs> the other one was close, too. Yep. Speed of the bombs. Oh, nobody's saying anything? Or, nope. No, quiet. They're so, in it's so intense. <laughs> the gameplay. Oh, I'm getting better. I can definitely say that. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out! Your power oh. station! Oh my goodness, that was so lucky. That one's coming for you. Lucky? Oh I no, it got it. you! Yeah, I didn't oh. get it. Oh! I thought it, uh, I thought it hit the side of it. Obviously oh, not far enough away. Slowsville for me, for oh, a couple yeah. waves. Well, protect your, uh... Your bullets don't slow down, just you, so... Just have to stay nearby, not get okay. too far away. Protect those five buildings I've left. Yeah. Yeah, you just do your thing over there. Yeah, I got it back. Oh, you did get it yeah. back. That's not the end of the season. Uh, round seven. I guess at every three. Oh. Now I can operate functionally again. Oh. Anticipate. Not too much. Not too little. <laughs> oh my goodness. This game is so nerve-wracking. <laughs> it's stressful. This it's is a stressful super game. super stressful game. Watch out. Again. Oh, oh my no, god. Again. I swear they're... Nope. It's oh, over. I got the last one. That's pretty good, though. Oh. 5,947. What? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> it takes away points after you die. I know, that's not It's fair. like, no, no. No, it's not very nice. Oh, terrible ranking. Yeah. But that's that's his best. I, I'm done. Yeah, it's yeah. It's so it's hard. Not, it's not a game. I, I think I have played it before. Yeah. Probably on the easy level. It's it's stressful. <laughs> <laughs> I know, exactly. And 4-9-4-7. <laughs> oh, screw that in. I know. Does it come with screws or no? Mm, I don't know. It might have. Yeah, well, this part did. Then oh. you took it off. Maybe it should be put back on. No. Why? This part? I don't know. I think that's the problem. Okay, now we're going to be moving on to Dog Gone It. And this is made by Andrew Armscar Coder. Um, this is Excellent. game mode one, left difficulty B, right difficulty B. Oh, is it already? Um, the scores go. Yeah, you're wasting time. Don't get it by the doggies. He'll take your package. Kitties. Oh, here comes a kitty. Bye. Oh, stretchies. Oh, there's a kitty. Go get that kitty. You get the kitty? Yeah, get the kitty. Or not. I don't know. Maybe don't get the kitty. I can't remember. <laughs> Let's uh, see. Yeah. You're not helping me here. What does the kitty do? Nothing. Crazy culvert kitty. If Hank pets the crazy culvert kitty, then when she walks from one culvert to the other, a randomly chosen power-up is stored in Hank's power pocket, and we oh. will be depicted by its respective icon, which is fast feet, so if you want to move fast. But if you don't use it, you get bonuses at the end, so I wouldn't yeah, use I it. Yeah, I remember that. Don't get it by the doggy. So you get 200 points for package deliver. 500 points for a package delivered while double package power-up is activated, which you don't have. That's a times two. Yeah, I remember that. A uh, thousand points for unused power up and power pocket. So you got that, which is good. Poodles. <laughs> Therapy dogs. Is I remember what that. Called. Yeah, it's funny. And then the next ones are hot dogs. They have a little wavy, wavy. Get that cat. Don't get hit by. Actually, I don't think. I... Oh, he hit me. I thought I was far, far enough away. Get that Culver kitty. Meow, meow. Use the left joystick, move Hank up, down, left, and right. Oh. Press the fire button to start a new level to activate a power up um, ah. stored in Hank's. What is going on? You have to deliver your package. Are, have they been flashing that whole time? Uh, nope. Oh, there we go. There's the fast feed. It didn't work last time. Oh. Well, you got an extra power up. 
dog invincibility, and you use the dog invincibility. That's why they're what? flashing. Oh, I thought I only got one. Oh, I used the la- oh, I see. Because you hit the cat twice. Yeah, because- what? Confused. I'm confused. What do you mean I hit the cat twice? You had fast feet. Yes, but I thought you, you get you, a bonus when you go from level to level. You do. So you don't want to use them up if you don't have to. But then you got a cat again. Yeah. You don't lose it from uh, level oh. to level. Oh, okay. You keep That's it. fine. Yeah. Okay. That's what I didn't understand. That After you get the kitty, dogs don't hurt for a while. <laughs> if you get the right bonus. Oh, they don't hurt for a while even like normally flash, getting right? the kitty? You, you oh. flash. <gasps> kitty. Go pet that cat. Someone is clearly a cat lover. Yes. Go pet that cat. Where's the stinky dogs? <laughs> oh, he got me. Oh, they pause you. for Not for long. Not very long. Oh, there. See, you're invincible. Yeah. Briefly. From the dogs. Briefly. Not very long. Still invincible. Do they, do they flash or give you an indicator? Oh. Or do they just stop? It's a very quiet game. Hot Let me dogs. Turn it up a bit. Getting caught around the edges here. If you have a power up stored, you get another power up when petting the crazy covert kitty. <laughs> so the, the power ups layer then. Yes. They and do. you use your newest one first. <sighs> and this one is Tinker the dog. Tinker? Oh. He's a big puppy. He's like a running great, around. Great Dane. And you're delivering a package to Oliver. He sounds like he's, a little boy. He's ordering his toys from, from Amazon online. A lot of toys. He's gotten a hold of his parents' credit card. Oh, I'm fast for a while. Oh, nice bonus. Did you, you know why? I keep pressing the button. That's why. Why are you pressing them? Oh. I keep forgetting. You. I thought, uh. Oh, well, it's something. You, you only need to use the joystick. I'm moving fast, though. Yep. Okay. So the lowest score is 14,000. The highest score is 46,000, yeah, and the mid me. score is about 28. Okay. I think you could it's not, You could get on the it's board. It's hard to say how hard it gets. Uh, the person who has the top score, hmm. or near the top score, uh, takes half an hour to get it. Yeah, that wouldn't surprise me. Yeah. There's a sound when the power-up is activated. I think it's really quiet, so I'm going to turn it up. Yeah, you can hear it, but it's not very, very high. There we go. That's it, loud enough. Now we can hear the footsteps. Yeah, it's a quieter game. Let me turn it up for you guys, too. Kitty! Did you get it? Yeah, yeah. So you've got fast. Fast feet uh, in your arsenal. So that's Dr. C. And Dr. H is on the left. And there's a very nice story. Well, not a nice story, but a good yeah. story behind it. Uh, what inspired him. Mm. Um, everybody can read that on the Atari Age forum. Tips for getting a high score in Doggone It. Finish each level as quickly as possible to maximize the end of level bonus points. Uh, it, the best tip I can give is carry, to sto carry a stored up power to the next level for a thousand bonus points. Mm -hmm. Plus you get to keep the power up. Uh, if using the double package power-up, wait until you're about to deliver a package before activating it. Then you may be able to deliver two packages while the power-up is activated. Ah, that's a good one. Well, we're almost to the bottom of the scores. Uh, a thousand points for two packages, stinky puppies. In my opinion, the dog invincibility and fast feet power-ups are the best power-up for the later rounds, especially level three. If you have a power-up stored you don't like, they are awarded at random, use it before Crazy Culvert Kitty comes out so you can store another power-up. Ah, did you get the cat? There you go. So you have... That one is double package, so you should use it just before you deliver a package. I did. Oh, the one I have... Ne yeah, 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 yeah. This is the fast feed one. Yeah, but I'm it. not going to do it till the next level. Oh, yeah. Okay. Because it's you easier just to it store it up, and then you, then you use it, and then... You want you get your thousand, then you use it the next level. Yep. And then you try and deliver two packages while it's activated. Yeah, and you. Oh. Stinky puppies. Stinky. They're, I know they're hot, but 
Hot puppies are stinky puppies. <laughs> That's Let's <true>. face it. <laughs> Let's be honest here. On this level, you can hit the gong. Not this level, but the last level. You can hit the gong in the middle to pause the dogs. Yeah. I always forget about that. Mm. Um, so what is this mm. level? What is stinky it? dogs? The hot dogs. What's, this, what's the stinky dog level? Where is the gong? <laughs> it's in the second level. The dog's fast now. Fast tinker. Oh, you're almost to the bottom points. 14,000. <gasps> Culver Kitty. Go pet that cat. Pet that cat. You're invincible? No. No! Oh, oh he you takes no package. my package. Shit. He tore it up. Oh, tore it to pieces. That was my double. Oh, you still have double. No. No, it's gone. No. No, it's, it's gone. I didn't get to use it. I used my double. You have another right one. Right before the kitty. It doesn't matter. I want the thousand points. So I'm going to oh. hold on to it until the next one. Well, I thought you were saying you don't have one. But you do. No, but I... I because he stole my package, this stupid dog. Um, <laughs> oh my goodness. This guy. Um, <laughs> That's a big dog. Oh, it's a factory on the third level. Okay. Might have to use the double. Yeah, just to finish the level off. Yeah, I'm really slow right now. Let's you see. have three to go. I would do it, yeah. Now you just have one, which is Not as bad. probably the wise move. Oh, kitty! Oh. Meow, meow! That is dog invincibility. No. Well, it doesn't matter. Oh. Wow. Yeah, it doesn't matter too much. You kind of need the package and then hit it because a you dog, don't have enough time. A dog could pass for a horse. <sighs> So there's the gong. So if you go down the middle, which is kind of the out of the way way to go. No, it's useless. Oh. oh, that's useless. That's not useful at all. It's too short. Yeah. Yeah. Kitty. Uh, in my opinion, da, 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 let's see. Uh, pay attention to the music while a power-up is active. When its pace quickens, you have three seconds of power-up remaining. Dog movements left to right are random, but vertically they move in one direction until they hit the top or bottom. Oh, that's a good hint. Then switch their vertical direction. The dogs moves a little different vertically for each level, but they all follow this behavior, behavior making them a little more predictable, at least vertically. Oof, like the close. DVD sign the way they're bouncing around vertically <laughs> ding, ding, corner ding. to corner yeah a little bit Oof. that getting close to the end whoa that was close good use of the double uh on level two striking the gong in the middle of the room will force the therapy dogs to po pause momentarily so Just. that's a truck pause if you get in big trouble, which... Oh my god! Oh no. Yeah, you might want to use it. Yeah. Those dogs are so fast now. They are anxious therapy dogs. <laughs> Come on, go to the other side of the room. Actually, it pauses it for quite a while. Yeah. Uh, the gong can be used as many times as desired, but Hank must leave the waiting room and re-enter before using the gong again. Oh, okay. Stinky puppies. Uh, going out, going to the outside is the safest, but it takes more time. There's no score penalty for coming into contact with a dog, so when returning to the truck, it's usually quicker to go to the shortest path, even if you're momentarily stunned once or twice. That's a good hint. So... Oof. Whoa, you that get, was close. You get caught, unfortunately, on this level quite a bit. It's a lot of things to get caught. Oh on. my goodness! This is this is not going to end well. This level? No, because you, I keep getting caught. What did you use? Double? Package? Yeah. If 
I get twice. Oh, that was lucky. <laughs> Did not think I was going to get it twice. Oh, you used it twice? Oh. Yeah, I actually managed to nice. use it twice. Yeah, going directly up while you don't have a package is a very fast way to get back. Oh my goodness. I'm past these dudes. There you go, and you're done the Good. level. Good job. Woo! Starting with Route 5, Crazy Culvert Kitty will move faster. Be careful not to be stuck near the bottom when she comes out, or you may miss her. Oh my, oh my god. This guy is super fast. Was it always seven packages? Nope. It oh goes up god. every round. There's the Culvert Kitty. Go for it. Just go for it. You only get paused for a second. Way faster than uh, going around. Uh, if you have any further tips, I'd love to hear them. Hope everyone enjoys playing Dog Gone and I'm looking forward to following the high scores achieved. Oh, whoa, that was close. Are you using fast feet? Yeah. yeah. So, you're now... Fourth from last. On the board. Fourth from last? Yep. Almost fifth from last. so slow compared to the animals. <laughs> yeah, what's well, been a hard day of delivering packages to, to little Oliver? It says, yeah, when you get, when you don't have a package, returning to the truck might as well go up the middle. Yeah. This dog just hit me six times. <laughs> it's still faster than going around the edge because he's so slow. But I think on this level, with that speed, going to the edge is probably the safest. I mean, oh my god, you still have two left. That culvert kitty would come in handy. Definitely get that culvert kitty. Could be anything to help you. Dog invincibility. Doesn't matter. No? No, it's, it's not going to matter at this point. So is it when the truck touches the edge of the screen? Yeah. Or is it when it's all the way off the screen? I think off you can make screen. it. Do it now. Or no. If he gets close. There you go. You're almost there. Oh, yes. Barely. You got an extra thousand points. <laughs> Woo. Get the cat. Get the cat. <laughs> this, is, this is stupid. This is stupid. These dogs are stupid. <laughs> These dogs are stupid. <laughs> These dogs are stupid. They're very agitated. It's like, I don't think I can do this without the invincibility. It's craziness. <laughs> Get that cat. Pet it. Pet the cat. Pet that cat. Good. Truck pause. Oh, there you go. That's how you do it. Gives you a touch more time. What are you waiting for? What are you doing? Get out I'm of there. Just, just stuck. Don't have time to mess around. I would go down the middle. No, it's not better. No? No. Oh, fuck Oh, yeah. no. It is not better to go down the middle. I don't find that gong helpful at all. Have to use the gong, try hitting closer to the side. Yeah, I would, well, the truck, oh my There's god. There's nothing, this is a terrible, these guys are so fast. It's so... The gong. It's not gonna help me. Just it's barely. Just, you just barely make it. They are too fast to not use the gong at this point, Metal Lunar yeah, 7 says. Yeah, I can kind of see that. Oh, I can't. Get that cat. Truck pause. No. They are too fast. Go! No time to wait. that gong on the way in no I don't oh, oh fuck, my I'm goodness screwed. yeah I don't think I think this is gonna be the end I should get a culvert kitty and get double packages or something if you get a cat and it pauses the truck then maybe no Nope, 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 nope. Oh, <laughs> the truck's Not running chance. away. Look how fast. Oh, Dog. That was pretty it. good, though. 
23? Yeah, momentary invincibility. Yeah, but I mean, you don't, it doesn't last very long. Close. What was it? Two, 23, 275? Yep. Yeah, what's the, There's the scoreboard. low score? Well, it's not bad. Mom's scoreboard. I don't know if um, Arena Foot's still in the chat. If somebody could type T and then 23275. Please, <laughs> please. I always think of Darcy. <laughs> Delivering packages. Yeah, because he so did that for a while did. in his early days. He did. Culvert Kitty. Meow. He runs away, though, when you try and pet We've him. We've got a Culvert Kitty. He's down on the floor. Oh, here. hi, Culvert Kitty. He's in the culvert. He is in the culvert. Between us and, and the um, Atari in the In system. the cat cam, he's just like half on the screen. Is he? So, yeah. And not fully? Yeah, just his face. His head's on the screen. Atari and pixel cam? Yeah. No pixel, though. He's no. bad and now he's gone. He attacked me and he said, my job is done. <laughs> oh, Arena Foot's still here. Yay, thank you very thank much. You. Crazy Culver Kitty only comes out <laughs> twice per level. Can you mm. read that? Yeah, uh, comes out twice per level. Once left to right, then right to left. I've only... A lot of levels go by fast. The ones that go by fast, you only see them once sometimes. Right, yeah. So maximum twice. Yeah, because on the last level, it was only once. Yeah, left to right, right to left. Oh, I'm invincible, aren't I? Is that what I am? I don't know. I don't, I don't know. know what you... I, I didn't press anything. No. I don't know what's going on. Oh! Drexel Yay, just subscribed! Drexel! Drexel's watching! He heard us, he heard us say his him. name. We're <laughs> delivering packages! Yep. In your honor. In your honor. Chat room lag, still Twitch issues. Oh, yeah. okay. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Two stinky puppies. Hmm. Come on, get out of the way, stinky. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, kitties. Come here, kitty. Oh, it's because I'm layering. I, it's yeah. forcing me to use, to use my bonus up. because I've not been using them because I want the bonus. Yeah, which is fine. Because you don't get bonus for how quickly you do the level, do you? No. So might as well take the bonus. if you. Yeah, you only need one bonus, right? Yeah. To get the thousand, so. Yeah, I wonder if it's better to stop a truck, more bonus for time left over, or take the 500 points for not using it. Do you get time? Do you get score for time left over? I don't think so. I have to pay attention. I wasn't paying attention. Oh. Fast speed. Nice. Thank you, kitty. Now you have <laughs> 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 Go fast feet. Oh, now I feel so sluggish. Yeah, you get time Need bonus, but nowhere coffee. near a thousand. Yeah. Oh, okay. Hi, Lopta. Good morning. <laughs> Wherever you are in the world. Oh, yes. In Europe, I'm guessing, because that's kind of morningish yeah. now. Plus seven? I don't know. It? Depends where they are. Plus too. seven. No, that would be very, very yeah. early. No, 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 no. Okay, they're in Australia then. <laughs> if they're saying good morning. Okay, gong dogs. See? Very helpful. Mm, a little bit. As long as you time. know the direction they're going in, then you're okay. Like, if you know they're going up or down. Or... They always go in the same up and down direction. Well, yeah. No, they turn around, but... They turn around left to right. They can, they can turn down. into you if you're not careful, so... I guess that's... Uh... But on the fast levels, it almost yep. doesn't even make a difference because they're so fast. Laptop says it's always more than somewhere. Oh, I pressed the button. Oh my god. Uh, the truck position triggers the cat, so only one at a time. Oh. 
Okay, so where the so if you finish the the level early early, you don't get two cats. You just get one. Oh, okay, makes sense. So that's kind of good. So if you're doing like not so yeah, so not so I good, mean, you get a second around. cat. Yeah. You bloody dogs. It does Yay. give you a tiny bit of time. Yes. Oh, you get the bonus for how much further so you do get a the truck bonus. is going off. But you don't screen. get a thousand is what, what no. they were saying. So that's quite a bit of bonus. That is stinky, stinky puppies. <laughs> stinky oh, kitty. The so the kitty comes right away. And then a little bit later, yeah. towards the end. Oh, times two. Yeah. Nice. So it might be, well, I don't know. Is it worth, it's probably worth waiting for the second kitty if you don't have it. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So you so could use, use your two time. I want, the, I want the thousand. A thousand points is huge yeah. for this competition. No, stinky. But like if you do. Oh my God. It's better because you don't get a thousand for the bonus of the truck going off okay. the screen. So it's better to hold on to it if you can if unless yeah. you're gonna die and then use it to save yourself come on flip over there we go because i have enough time to do all of it do yeah. all of it maybe i'll get a kitty no i don't know where i think it triggers very close to the end it right does, yeah like Yay! as close to the end as it does in the beginning at the beginning yeah yeah so yeah you only need one for the next level yeah so if you always keep one going yeah but you could you could use your power up once it gets harder immediately and then get the kitty and then get the second kitty because you probably will oh. be, be rushing to the end or wait for the second kitty yeah. before you deliver the last one but um anyway because you, you you just want a power up i mean i think i when when i was getting to seven packages it was so frantic it was so hard that you were using both sometimes I notice in your game the dog doesn't go to the left hand side of the screen like all the way to the side of the screen no, very much. You, it's, so that's why you're better off running down the full length. He does a little bit. Especially when he's fast. But he doesn't always go it does doesn't always go to the end. When he gets really fast, it's you're not better much off. Slower, especially running navigating down the, these trees. You like going straight back is fine, oh, but yeah. um but you wanna take the edges. I think the edges are faster. But yeah, he's not that fast right now, now but when you hit seven, it gets crazy. Now the truck's in the middle. It's a bit yeah. of a longer stretch to go around the side. But he's not moving as fast. So. No, not, like when he was on your level that you ended up on, it was like, pfft, oh my Is this gosh. a 7,800 game? No, it's, an, it's a 2,600 game. Armscar Coder takes that as a very big compliment. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's a 2,600 game. Just beautiful graphics yeah. and fun Mm. Kitties and puppies and delivering packages. Yeah. These are the crazy dogs. And they're even crazier than ever. Oh my god. Don't turn around. No. They can, but usually they keep going in the direction they're going. Yeah, in. They're pretty crazy, crazy dogs. Yeah, they are crazy dogs. Get that what kitty. What am I going to get? It's a paw. Squish that cat. Am I invincible? Squish it, what good. Am I? I don't know what you have. Oh, no, nothing. you you don't do that. You don't do that. <laughs> Silliness. You do this. That's what you do. Oh, you can only hit it once. This is on the outside. Dunk. That's almost enough time to get. <laughs> it is a big dog. In. <laughs> It's a very big dog. The, dog, dog. Oh, the dog. Yeah, the, in the last screen. Oh, it's massive, massive dog. It's like uh, that's definitely a Marmaduke. Marmaduke dog. What yeah. dog is that? Great Dane. Great Dane. Yeah. Two packages. And you would have to have been old enough to read comic <laughs> strips to know that reference. So everybody here is definitely old knows enough. what Marmaduke is. <laughs> I've seen our statistics. There's nobody under 24. Oh, really? <laughs> like, like uh, literally, literally, at least on YouTube, because they have better statistics. Like yeah. Literally zero. Under 24. That's fine. 
I can't. I'm, or is I'm it, cool with that. It might have even be under 34. Yeah. Under 30. No, 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 no. Was, there are definitely a few younger people. It was a shocking watching. statistic. But it's, it's, so. it's quite, hey, it's, it's mm -hmm. quite skewed to the, the older age range for sure. But well, yeah. no, under 24, that makes sense to me. They'd be looking at this going, Fast I don't even know what nice. I'm looking at. You know, like, <laughs> what, are, what are these blocks? No puppies. No. Fast feet didn't help me much. A little bit. Mm. Oh, still going. That helped. You gonna move? Yeah, I thought so. Locked. I'm gonna unplug my Ethernet cable and try Wi-Fi. Yeah, a lot of people are having trouble today. <laughs> really? Well, that's Twitch then, not mm. me. We are perfect streaming. Mm. Not a second end. lost. Yeah. Twitch is getting every bit we're sending. Oh my god. I Dude. love it when he runs away from you. Yeah, he's like, do you want the package? Yeah. He's like, I'm busy. I'm doing work. I'm in a factory. Well, what he does it? have a mustache. He's the foreman. So, so I just take that as he's too busy for anyone else. Um, okay, move over here now. No offense to anyone with mustaches. But yeah. Dogs on fire. They are hot dogs. We like to call <laughs> them stinky dogs. They, they seem have stink st lines. They have stink lines. <laughs> <laughs> fleas. Yeah. Or fleas. <laughs> Okay, I'm on. Yeah, Great Dane level. This this is where it gets really hard, I find. Yeah. Yeah. When you have seven to deliver now, and this dog goes insane. He gets really fast. He's like super fast. Yeah, going down the edge on this is. Is definitely the way to go, yeah. yeah. You do have a double power up. I may use that on this. It's we'll not a terrible it idea because it's going to be forced on you. Fast feet. I'll take that down is the side. Is it fast feet or yeah. is it the double? No, because I just hit the cat. I didn't use anything. So it gives you a random one that you don't get to see oh. when you already have one. It's not fast feet. You usually go blue, don't you, if you have fast feet? Oh, invincibility. Oh, I should have gone down the middle. Mm. That's what it was. Oh, doing good. Yeah, I think I'll be able to make it. Yeah. If everything doesn't go awry. Get down. <laughs> yeah, I uh, should be okay. Dog. Captain Classic is saying, use the two times. You're doing, mm -hmm. you're doing okay right now. I'm fine. I want that thousand points. Yeah. I really want that. Well, there's points. another kitty coming out, so. But uh, um, not yet. Not enough time. I'm about to deliver the last package, so, and I don't get back to the top when the kitty comes. Out. I just stop here, so. Yeah, no, no. Yeah, you're okay. You've got a lot yeah. of space. It's good to keep the two times. So you get like, mm, that was not bad, like 500 points. Yeah. Oh, crazy puppies. Crazy puppies. They're like crazy. Okay, bring that gong. Yep, that's the way to do it. Go down the center, ring the gong. Kitty, kitty, what are you going to give me? Fast feed. Thank you very much. Oh, God. <laughs> With the fast feet, I was able to make it all the way in, which is good. No, you gotta gong it. Yeah. I don't think you have much choice. Oh, you can't get past them. Oh, it's not gonna be good. <gasps> I knew it. Mm, I knew it. They're I knew really it. bad. Oh, I, these guys are really bad. Haha, <laughs> sequel to this game could be the Amazon Prime delivery guy. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. I think I'm going to use the double because I think I'm going to make it to the second cat. I'm going to wait a couple packages here. You're doing well. Your score is pretty high. Oh, in terms of score, yeah. yeah. But on this level, uh... it's hard. When you hit the seven, it just starts to get really hard. You're missing the chance to get multiple power-ups. Captain Classic is getting quite irate. Uh, <laughs> you're missing the chance to get multiple power-ups from the kitty. If you use the power-up at the start of the level, you would get a power-up back when the kitty comes oh. out. Oh, oh my god. You missed the kitty. Oh my god. Oh, I you can, see. You can freeze, you can freeze the, um, the truck. <sighs> How about I want 1,000 points? Oh, you have double. So oh, I never see. mind. So use up the power-up at the beginning of the level. So I will do that. 
These dogs. Stinky. <gasps> so stinky. So now the kitty comes out in a second. Because I've frozen the truck, so he won't come out. Not immediately, and it's gonna be totally but he will. Mistimed. No. Oh. Is he coming out? No. Well, just, you can wait. Oh, uh, that to. kind of defeats the whole purpose. <gasps> dogs. Oh, I'll catch oh, there him. There he is. I'll catch him, I'll catch him, I'll catch him. Thank you, Captain Classic. But, I mean, you don't get points for using it, do you? No, see, but now you'll get a thousand points. No, but it just helps you. It helps It helps your game. Mm, a little bit, yeah. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness, no! Oh, you can freeze the truck, at least. Oh, yeah. we've got cats, and cats. they're licking. They're licking each other on camera. That's the... Uh, that's just before they start fighting. Yeah, I'm gonna they're putting on a show. This. Where does he move to? He goes back and forth? Yeah, okay. Just go straight back, straight back. Mm. If he can. Mm. Mm. Bigger issues. I'm gonna have to pause that truck and get the second kitty power up. <gasps> that's the worst thing to do. Worst. Going down the side. Mm. Don't have time for this. Get, get the kitty, get yeah. the kitty. Ooh, that's a good one for this. What? Oh, I've lost the package. No, you didn't have it. Puppy stole it from you. <gasps> no! You can't do two at once and you can't replace it. Yeah, you might... It's hard. It's hard. It's hard. I'm gonna die when you hit now. Seven. It's really hard. Well, you can you can get invincibility if you absolutely need to. I had to use it. Yeah, I don't know if you're gonna make it, but you can at least run back. With no, because there's no more kitties, and that truck is gonna be gone. Yeah, it is hard. And it's gonna run out soonish. Nope. There's no chance. It's almost off the oh, screen. Oh, you got so lucky that dude. A materialized in front of you. No, it's going to be off the screen, though. Uh, two more pixels, one more pixels. Oh, oh doggone it. Excellent. 32,479 is pretty good. Pretty good. Is it? It's not bad. Yeah, it's Top pretty 10. good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eighth place. Yeah. I got on the board. I'm pretty happy with that. It's not. I'll it, take my it. My score wasn't I'll terrible. I'll take it. Oh, thank you, Armscar Coder. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I definitely could have got better, probably by using Captain Classics. Like, use it every time. Yeah. Before the kitty comes on. Before the yeah, do it at, right at the beginning. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Lopta. Sorry to hear that. Oh, Buffering. No. He needs a new house. I need to, <laughs> or yeah. a new connection. Yeah. That'll fix it. The new house. Oh, I don't. Yeah, it's a long game. So I don't know if I could play it again right now. Yeah, it is. I think I could do better. Yeah. Because that was my first game, right? Yeah. <laughs> Eighth place in my first game. Hmm. Hi. Are you causing trouble? Yes, yes. Um, that was intense just watching it. <laughs> it's a lot of action. It's it's precision. It's a fun game. It's action. It's, it's figuring out what to use when. And there's, it's kind of got an, a maze element to it as well. Mm -hmm. It's got a lot of different uh, things going on at the same time. Mm -hmm. um, and a nice ramp up in difficulty. And can you believe Armscar Coder just put this out? Yeah, I remember that's that. It. Yeah, 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 yeah. He has not ever changed a thing on it yeah. because nothing it is wrong with it. It just works perfectly, yeah. There's nothing wrong with this. Yeah, okay. Armscar Coder, did you have anybody beta test this game? Or did you just do it and went done and it's perfect yeah because <laughs> i i know in the the thread yeah for the high score club somebody mentioned that they said this is just this game is perfect right out of yeah. the gate yeah 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 i played it a lot yeah it shows yeah it shows quite a bit yeah he beta tested it he didn't he didn't takes a little bit of luck around. with the power-ups yeah because yeah, you don't know what you're getting yeah but what i was using i was using it power-ups as i touched the cat because yeah. you get it. So I kind of did it anyway. You were using it, but you would get to control when you used it a little bit better. If yeah. You, if, you, if you picked it before the cat showed up. So I get That's I get true. that approach. Um, Captain it would help Classic. a little bit more. Yeah. So you had a few friends and family play it. Probably had three versions. That's really yeah, good. that's really good. It's simple but, and But you it had works. something in your mind that you knew was yeah. going to make for a fun game. Yeah. And it 
it does. Yep. That's, that's really great. Cool. Um, so I'm pretty happy with how I did. I think I want to revisit uh, Miss Galactica. Yes, I would like to too. Because I think we both can do better. Oh uh, yeah, I it. actually, I actually, I agree. Um, this is a long game. I don't. I think I'm gonna stick with this score. I'm definitely gonna stick with the last score too mm. of of City of Defense because that's a very hard game. It's not definitely not my forte. I, I the moment we started playing with it, I'm like, no, I'm frustrated already. I, 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 I I'm like, oh, I remember playing this game, mm -hmm. and I think it took me a few plays to get into it. Mm. But um, it's so precise, and the the blast radius is so small, and there's such a gap if you have to if you have to explode it mm -hmm. far away that you. I think you just have to take some time to get used to the the timing. Um, yeah, and, I, and just and I when we better. started playing, yeah, you did get better. But I still, it's not I just my type of game. Immediately went, oh no, this isn't the kind of game I'm gonna. I'm gonna get. <laughs> I'm not excel at. It. I'm not gonna excel yeah. at this game. I'm gonna get um, okay, but not even okay. Yeah. I'm gonna get competent. <laughs> Whereas Miss Galactopus, I feel like I want to sit with it and play it a little yes. bit. And uh, I think there's I would room get for improvement. It's timing stuff. Yeah. Yeah. I Once think I could get quite down. a bit better yeah. on that. Yeah, and the there's luck involved with the, with the missiles. Luck yeah. involved in Miss Galactopus, which makes you think you can do better. Yeah, it's, it's like, true. oh, that was bad luck. It yeah. Was, oh. oh, I have to try again. <laughs> yeah, it's true. There's something about games that have that element in there that you just want to keep pushing and pushing and pushing. I mean, all three have, they're all random. None of them are exactly the same. Yeah, that's um, true. Very, very, like, a game without randomness. Yeah. It's not even a game, really, because you know exactly what's going to happen. Is there any games without randomness? No, there. Were, I'm sure there are. There are some that are just so technically specific that... There's puzzle games. Like Space Invaders? Like Pit Cat. Pit Cat's exactly the same each time. Space Invaders is the exact same each time. It's the same That's every true. time. There are a lot there, of games like that, but yeah, I, I, think, too... I think the best ones have that element of luck and the dice throw, right? Yeah. The timing is difficult yeah. with the missile. Very hard. Yeah. yeah. So uh, today we played Rail Slider. Uh, my only uh, comment on that is to bring the boss in earlier to break up the gameplay. That yeah, I agree with that. Yeah, it's a fun game. At around three thousand or five thousand. I would say five thousand if you have it. We also weren't weren't playing it properly. No. Which we discovered at the end. You have to use that power up <laughs> to yeah. go zap and get a thousand points yeah. each yeah. robot. Um, so that might change it, but I think you still might be able to bring it down. I'm not I, sure. A thousand a robot will adds up a lot. You only need to get ten, and then you're good, right? Yeah. Yeah. So maybe we we're just we were just playing it wrong. Yeah, it took us longer than it. That's should've. true. Pitfall yeah. is is not random at all. No, it's the same every time. There are quite a few games like Grand that. Prix, Freeway. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Is Freeway exactly the same? Yeah, I guess the cars go at the same pace. Anything yeah. by Activision. That's true. True. Mm -hmm. Looking at, yeah, Stampede even is not random. Keystone Capers isn't random. Boxing, well, that's not it. Looking at all the Activision games here. It's sitting in front of you there, yeah. Sky Jinx, Crackpots. Wow, that's an interesting observation, actually. Anything by Activision, they didn't use any Those randomization. Early days, there was no randomization. I, I wonder when the first random game on the 2600 was hmm. because it's not obvious how to do randomization i don't think hmm. hmm interesting observation oink oink's random i'm pretty sure oink's random because hmm. it's crazy it's just all over the place Ice or it's ra random true yeah uh, oink is so fast maybe it isn't random because the guy's just shooting his things to destroy the bricks yeah um, but it's so crazy, it might as well be random. Yeah. Yeah. So, but a lot of them, that's an interesting observation. Mm. Yeah. Um, and we played RC Sumo Bots, which, uh, got a good improvement with the bouncing. Uh, that'd be, that's uh, a fun game. Yeah, 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 yeah. We were, we were, we were enjoying the physics more than actually, we weren't really <laughs> playing, playing each other, but. Well, because it, it was new and, uh, like, we wanted to. Play around with Let it. Let me yeah. bounce off this pillar for a while. Okay, most Activision games. <laughs> yeah, not all. But maybe all. Maybe they just, like, ice hockey. Ice hockey may not be random. It may be reactive. 
like the you're here it goes here kind yeah, of thing it always does the same it's thing possible i don't know where yeah. you are i don't know yeah i don't know you have to look at the code yeah tennis bridge i yeah mm, yeah yeah arena foot's got some points there mm -hmm. miss galactopus awesome oh it's such awesome. a good game yep that's such a great uh game. city defense uh hard <laughs> yeah it is hard hard not my game no. uh doggone it i love doggone it so much That's fun so yeah um really great cover to that as well mm -hmm. and uh yeah he's he posted in the forums recently that he's sending out a bunch of free cards to people oh nice and i'm so lucky to be on that oh, list oh nice yeah. Wait, getting a dog on a cart yeah nice yeah so i'm really well, looking forward fun. to that well we'll have to play it more <laughs> oh definitely yeah when, when it comes when it comes to the mail we're gonna do an unboxing yeah. um or the canucks random yeah we're worried? not the people to ask <laughs> wrong people no no i uh, know they're they're from what i know they're pretty steady about squeaking into the uh playoffs and then losing terrible yeah that is actually true <laughs> that's usually their, yeah. their modus operandi yeah yeah except for one year where they where everybody rioted because they lost at the last second when they made it to the finals yeah that was the Game year seven we actually finals. had tickets do you remember that was the year we had tickets wasn't it no way or was that before no we would have gone to that game if we had tickets no we didn't we sold the tickets I before think. the end of the season we sold the tickets no because no. we sold a bunch of them we watched we, some of the playoff games and we sold some of them but we sold them as the games went on we didn't sell them all the way up um, yeah because they i thought that was the year we had we tickets. would have gone to game seven if we had that ticket no you're There's right yeah no it chance. was like the year a year or two after that mm -hmm. yeah because we had seasons tickets oh it was ridiculous we didn't buy them it was ridiculous um yeah they're very expensive so that when they came to be renewed we we're like how many thousands yeah no thank you uh no thanks we no. will get rid of these thank yeah. you <laughs> <laughs> they're pretty expensive yeah um so uh next tuesday um we're going to be going for the astronomer patch and that's all i have queued up right now i'm sure some games will be filling in mm -hmm. um uh, and we'll probably be playing this Galactopus again, actually, because that would not be the last day to play it, but the second last stream to mm. play it. And people are coming to do the renovations, to look at the renovations. So that is happening. But well, we don't know exactly when. Soon-ish. It's moving yeah. along. So we'll keep you updated. They're coming on Monday. So will be able to tell you on Tuesday, maybe when the gap will be. Because we can't do the show really properly. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Because um, yeah. there's a lot of equipment. The biggest thing is the TV. That that we play on. And the computer. It might be possible. It might be possible. But the couch is so far from the TV. Uh, the couch is so far from my computer where it's going to be. And that has to be strong. Well, we don't have to sit on a couch. We can sit on chairs. These things exist, so what? <laughs> so things might change. We might be able to figure something. We out. might yeah. be able to, because yeah. it would be nice to. Arena might... foot. Homebrews have slowed down lately. This is true. This they is have true. Quite a bit. In yeah. the summer, it was like. Or in boom, the spring. Boom, 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 in the boom, boom, spring, boom. it went crazy. It was like yeah. everyone's like, "We got time. We're everybody, stuck at home. Everybody got locked Working down. on our homebrews. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So. Yeah, everybody yeah. back to work and back doing things mm -hmm. and out of the house now. Yeah. a little bit more a little bit more yeah um so yeah they all the energy has been expended into the homebrews yeah. terrified their kids are going back to school and then all the is there a season for homebrews mm -hmm. arena foot would know that is other he, than covid season because yeah. season. <laughs> i think arena i don't know if arena foot does this every year but he tracks when they come out mm, so um, he would he would know yeah he would know so that, he's the best guy to yeah. answer that question for sure um because i'm i don't keep track of when they come out i just throw them on the show it's like a new one. Yeah. No, an update. Put yeah. it on the show. Yeah. Yeah. Atari Age releases a PRG would be the season. Yeah. I mean, for boxed games. Yeah. yeah. For like fi final Well, people versions, so. are working towards it, right? Yeah. yeah that's definitely that. the season. So yeah. now-ish. Yeah. Or a month. Mm -hmm. month from now. When is it usually? September? September. PRG? Yeah. October. I mean, it, ch it changes. I thought it was October. This year it's October, but then it got canceled. No, it was August, then it got cancelled. Oh, it used to be October, yeah. and it's August. Yeah. Yeah. 
But this year, the glut of new ones are coming out in October. Mm. That's the latest so far. So mm. we're going to get a big bunch of them and do unboxing and look at the pretty pictures and mm -hmm. play through them again. Mm -hmm. 13, <laughs> 2,600 games. Hopefully it doesn't release them in staggered because shipping to Canada is a lot of money. Mm. It's annoying. Get I want them all, all at once. Together. Yeah. But if I get, if I wait for the second batch or whatever, then I'll be delayed and won't have them immediately to show on the That's show. True. Everybody already have them. Yeah. They won't care. And James is like, like, ah, why? Why? What's the point? <laughs> They'll be like, Everyone ah, everybody's, everybody's seen these. They've already Aww. unboxed them. Really? H-A-A-G is still on for November 2020. Really? Uh, yeah, that's wishful thinking. Yeah. I guess it's possible if they take all the precautions. And... Yeah. Oh, boy. I don't know if attendance is going to be massive. Very big for that. It's Does tough, it homebrew tough. season lag a month or two after the EEPROM harvest? <laughs> <laughs> there is an actual issue with that. What? Like having enough boards. Oh, to fulfill. Yeah, like, that wouldn't surprise like, me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, um, what's that Tetris clone that has the Russian name? Cheddary. Cheddary's been off the market for years. Mm -hmm. I haven't been able to get um, a copy of it for years. Like every PRG, I, I ask, oh, can you bring some Cheddary? It's like, I don't have any boards. But he's got <laughs> some this year, so I'm yeah. going to order it yeah, along with nice. Hunchy too. Nice uh houston expo owner said it was on with covid restrictions, restrictions yeah. yes empty carts or boards yeah, yeah. Ship empty carts. yeah um so thanks for tuning in we are done we've played all the games Yay. we've gotten some decent scores we're on the board we're on the board and we might gonna... we might revisit them before it's done so. we will yeah revisit miss galacticus yes maybe dog on it you feel yeah. like have some extra time yeah extra half hour yeah you're very welcome metal lunar yeah <laughs> anytime yeah or at least twice a week yeah uh metal thanks for tuning in metal lunar uh captain classic thank you uh it was a very fun show it's uh, always nice when there's goals yeah <laughs> uh arena foot uh lopta, lopta. uh arm dan scar avc coder. arm scar coder thanks for making that game yes it's a fun game so awesome very fun. Flackets. Yeah. Oh, same people talking. Oh, oh. Drexel, I know you were watching. Yeah. <laughs> or maybe you didn't. Maybe you just resubscribed. No, I think you probably uh, tuned in. Dan ABC. Dan ABC. Miss Command. Yeah. Uh, lots of people. Oh, that's it. Those are people talking. Everybody was at the beginning. Yeah, that's true. Three hours again, but I didn't feel like it dragged. No, it, it helps when you have a bunch of different things. To yeah, show. moving, yeah. moving, moving. When you're playing one game for two hours, Three that becomes hours. a problem. Oh <laughs> yeah. That seems to be our norm now. Three hours is about right. I almost I think. never make two hours. No, two hours is short. It feels Sometimes. short, which is weird. If anyone anyone said to me, "Oh yeah, you stream for three hours," like. <laughs> Like, but it goes by fast. But I do find when I hit the three-hour mark, I suddenly feel a little fatigued. Turn into a pumpkin. I do. <laughs> um, but three hours seems fine. I don't know. It doesn't uh, seem too long. I like Penelt, but those shows are only one game. Yes, Because you, exactly. you have to do one game on those. Cause yeah. Penelt's massive. Yeah. It's, and that, it's the single game shows that are hard. And I do plan yeah. on doing that again. And I'll probably do it when you're on because you didn't actually experience Penelt very much. No, you you... I played Penalt. Yeah, we just ground. We, but we were, we were grinding. grinding to get it so you and er Erlen can play it. And then I watched you die <laughs> while I was at work. And I was just thinking, uh, I spent like four hours leveling that? him up. And you died with Erlen within like the first hour. And, and I thought, yeah, never again. I'm not doing that. <laughs> it's, it's too late here. It just changed to DST. Oh, really? Well, I guess that's coming up. We'll change too. Oh, daylight! Really? Oh, is daylight Where are you? savings? Time? That's really early for switching, isn't it? Is it? Like it's still summer. Twenty-four hour steam. Uh, yeah. One day, maybe. I want to. I want to do the. Um. What did? What did we do? 12 we did a twelve-hour fundraiser. That was fun. Yeah. That was fun. You need a lot of people for that. You need people to come in and out. And, yeah. yeah. And, and. No one loses all their all their. <laughs> energy at any one given time and you need snacks yeah and you need a big <laughs> schedule of rotating games yeah lots of snacks yeah yeah we did a 12-hour fundraiser for stella for stella yeah and we raised 
thousands of dollars <laughs> for Stella. Yeah, it was, it was really good. It was a really nice community effort. A lot of people donated some amazing things for it. Yeah. And it raised a lot of money and people donated and watched and we played um, tons of games. I can't yeah. remember what games we played or what the schedule was. We just played a bunch of games. Yeah. Yeah, just games that we just... That we and you did a bunch of interviews too. You interviewed. People. Oh yeah, we had a lot of uh, yeah. developers uh, interviewing. So that kind yeah. of spaced things out a little bit too. Yeah, everything's saved on YouTube. Uh, you can check it out. Um, yeah. I don't know if Farina Foot wants to link it there. Uh, actually, it's really easy to find. I can do it faster because uh, Stella by Teleparade. There we go. Uh, it's in four parts, actually. Yeah, it's really long. Yeah. Uh, so I'll give you the first part, and you can go from there. Yeah. There's the first part to watch. Yep. If you feel like putting something on in the background for 12 hours. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. But it was a lot of fun, and we had all, all four people here. Yes. Um, playing all the... Yeah. Now you have to catch up on all the shows, all yes. 200 shows of three hours, so... How much is that? 600 hours of, of I can't content? believe how long it's... Yeah, how much con content. I don't know how many it. shows we've done. A lot. Now. You have to count them. No, because YouTube does that for me. Uh, have you put all of them on YouTube? Oh, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. So, we just go to YouTube Studio. Then we go to Playlists. Oops, go to Playlists. And it counts them up because I put them in Playlists. All the Let's Play. Oh, I see. Uh... Mm, that's not helpful. Yep, there it is at the bottom. 214 Let's Play. Wow. And then you have to add uh, interviews, hmm. which there are 18 of, uh, which are short or long. Hmm. But the Let's Play are 214. Uh, and then there's little ones. There's some stupid unboxing ones that I gave up a long time ago on because they take too long to do. <laughs> I like doing live shows and just being done with it. Um, and then there's a review I did. I don't do those anymore. Don't have time. Yeah. And then there's little events where we do uh, remote streams mm. and stuff. Yeah. Nice. So anyway, about 200, over 200 shows now. Yeah. Crazy. It's going to take me forever to download the internet. Stop making content. <laughs> it's a lot of stuff on the internet. Yeah. Yeah. It's better just to look for what you're interested in. The impromptu in. shows. Yeah. Where I just turn it on. Yeah. Those, those get added. Hi, to... we're here. Hi, all two people who, who, you yep. know, decided Tuned to respond in. to the Twitch notification. <laughs> Editing was always a time-consuming part. Yeah, and I yeah. I am an editor as as my job, so I yeah. have other things to edit yeah. before this that are way more top priority. Yeah. <laughs> so I just it's like hard. doing the lives. I just do it, and it takes hours to prepare for this show anyway. Yeah. So that's enough. Oh, and Lopt is following me on tw Twitter now. Thank you. <laughs> just got notified. Excellent. Um, so we're done, and we'll be back on uh, Tuesday. Tuesday. Uh, same time. Yep. As today. Six o'clock. With her again mm -hmm. and the cats. Me. So we'll see you then. Thanks mm -hmm. for hanging out, everybody. Yep. Have a good night. And have a good weekend. Bye bye.